Got this feeling inside that I can't put aside because I want you. Although I thought I was fine when I left you behind, I know I loved you. I got this feeling inside that I can't put aside because I want you. Although I thought I was fine when I left you behind, I know I loved you. Got this feeling inside that I can't put aside because I want you. Although I thought I was fine when I left you behind, I know I loved you. I got this feeling inside that I can't put aside because I want you. Although I thought. Yo, what's up, guys? How we doing? It's your boy, Worthy Prince, coming at you with another Lord's mobile live stream and potentially other games, too. <laughs> we might be playing some other things, too. We'll see. How's everyone doing? Hello, hello. Good afternoon. How's everyone doing? I've had a really good day today so far. It's been banging. We're going to talk a little bit about that, and then we're going to jump in and take a look at the collab, which we kind of, like, blew the lid on over the last few days. Uh, we've been looking at a lot of images. We've looked at all the emotes and the artwork and the skins and the castle skins. And yo, IGG, how's the witch hunt going? <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, it's cool, man. We've, we've literally blew the lid off this. So really today is just a case of kind of like connecting the dots now and just seeing exactly what those images were that we saw. Was it true or was were, were they fake? I guess we're going to find out in a minute and see if any of that stuff I showed you over the last couple of days was actually true or not, or if it was a load of crap. But we're about to find out, peeps. <laughs> anyway, before we go any further, I just want to say I had a really good afternoon today. Spent some time with my dad. I uh, went out to the cinema. I uh, went to go and see uh, June 2. I'm not going to give you guys any spoilers, don't worry, or any plot twists or anything like that. Just want to say it's a really really good movie it's about three hours long so get comfortable and uh yeah honestly what a banging movie like it was way better than the first one i loved it it was amazing so if any of you guys love sci-fi like that kind of thing space stuff if you like that then you should go and check out dune 2 it is amazing it's such a good film really really good ishmael in the chat says man prince is so underrated the man is entertaining. Oh, man, I appreciate that. Thank you so much, dude. There was somebody else who said something a minute ago. That's a really nice little comment that someone just made. Yo, free to play Rally Trap in the, uh, or free to play Lead Lords Mobile. Is that even a thing? I don't know. It says, dang, man, you look really good in sh very good shape with an obvious weight loss. It's truly great. Thanks, man. It's been crazy, right? It's been a journey. I ain't finished yet. We're still going strong, boys. We're still going strong. Yo, we're still losing the bit. We're still losing weight. Then we're going to start bulking. Oh, yeah, we're going to start bulking. We're going to get huge. We're going to get ripped, but not yet. I'm still losing weight right now, but hey, we're going to get ripped. We're going to get those heavy weights out. Start pumping iron, baby. Hell yeah. Let's go. What top am I wearing? It's a jumper. Do you like it? Look, it's like a, I don't know. It's like a. It's got a cat on it. This is a cat. It's a cat. 
I think it looks pretty cool. You like it? I think it looks kind of dope. I think it's a cool jumper. I think it's nice, man. It's a nice jumper. You like it? I think it's pretty nice anyway. It's different. I like I like different. I don't like wearing always the same kind of like threads. You know, I like to wear something a little bit different. I like people to be like notice it rather than wearing the same stuff all the time. You like it? I think it's pretty cool. It's comfy and it's warm. So that's good, I guess. Right. <laughs> um, all right, guys, let's jump into the game. Let's go and take a look and see if any of this stuff, which we looked at over the last couple of days, was real or if it was fake. Hello. Let's go take a look, shall we? Let's go. Well, okay. <laughs> well, first of all, look at the background artwork here. Look at the background artwork. It looks very similar to the thumbnail that I had on yesterday's stream. <laughs> or the day before yesterday's stream. Do you remember? It's interesting, isn't it? You know what's really interesting, chat? I'll show you something really interesting. Check this out. We're going to be just looking at some images as well as we go along, right? I'll show you something really, really interesting. Give me, give me, give me two seconds to show you something interesting. You know what? Yo, wouldn't it be really nice if I was able to get the artwork that's at the back of this collab without all these like graphics and stuff over it? Hmm, that would be really cool. I could use it to make a really cool thumbnail. If I could just get the artwork. <laughs> if I could just get a hold of the artwork without all of the stuff on the front of it, that would be kind of nice. But I mean, hey, we can always wish, right? We can always wish. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, I love this. This is so much fun. <laughs> okay, so we had the artwork correct. The artwork is correct. It's the back of the collab. So that's basically, that's pretty cool, right? Uh, okay, let's take a look at this then and see what's up. So these drone looking things, this looks like the item you're going to have to use to once again, it's a rehash of all the other collabs they've done. I knew this was coming. It's the photograph thing. It's the RNG thing. Um, I'm not a big fan of this, to be honest with you. I've, I mean, I've said it every time they've done this. The RNG is just annoying. Um, so, yeah, not, not, not again. It's just a re reskin of the previous collab events with the photographs, right? Same thing, you know. We'll look at what's in... Oh, hang on. We'll look at what's in there in a sec. Uh, but obviously, you need these drones. I thought that might be an artifact, but that's not the artifact. That's the drone thing you have to use to, like, spin to try and get the, the photographs. There is, of course, a store. As always, there will always be a store uh, where you can purchase these things as well. So that's awesome. Um, with regards to where you can get them from, you'll get one free find per day. I don't see anything regarding hell events or events or anything like that. Saying that, they might put some in Kingdom Labors. Maybe. I don't I don't know. Probably not, to be honest with you. Because there's still 19 days on it. So they're not going to add these midway through. So probably not. The only way you're going to get these is by getting the one free daily and probably the packs. So, yeah. It is what it is, right? It is what it is. Uh, it's, 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 it's not a great event at all because of the RNG aspect. Makes things stupidly expensive. It's just silly. We've already had this conversation though, right? Let's take a look at the prizes which you're going to be getting here. So look, we've got the first one, which is the emote. That's one of the emotes we showed on the stream the other day. So I got that correct. There it is. So the Ferocious Kong emote. We've already seen that before. Uh, the castle skin. <laughs> Yo, I told you, man. We got it correct. Look at that. That's literally the castle skin I showed you guys the other day. I got it bang on. We were bang on correct with that, weren't we? Yo, I bet IGG were throwing chairs the other day when we started posting up all these pictures. But yeah, basically, this was the image I had the other day. Where is it? I actually can't find it. Um, there we go. Oh, it's over there. Oh, I'm just... Sorry, bear with me a second, guys. I'm having, I'm having a technical issue right now. Ugh. Technical. That's... The, 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 the animation's kind of cool, though. That's the animation. The animation's kind of cool. I will be honest with you. The animation looks pretty good. 
If that does that inside your turf, that's going to be quite cool. Yeah, so this was the image I had the other day when I showed you. That was the blurred image of the castle skin I had the other day. We were pretty much bang on. It's exactly what it is. Um, so there you go. All right. That's the castle skin. And it's got the animation. Yeah, the castle skin's fire. Yeah, the castle skin looks pretty cool. I gotta be honest with you. It's gonna look kind of mad seeing Godzilla's all over the kingdom. Obviously, they're not gonna be doing that animation on the kingdom map. But, like, they'll be doing that inside your turf. So that's kind of cool. Look at that, look. The animation is kind of cool. Yeah, the, the animation... The, the, the castle skin's cool. I like the castle skin. Hopefully the castle skin's not going to be a pain in the ass to unlock. You need six pieces of puzzle to get it for seven days. There's another one of the emotes that I showed the other day. Okay. And then there you get one of the, one of the avatars. It's the, the, the Kong avatar. Okay. You get the Kong avatar. This one. I showed, I showed a bunch of stuff the other day. I can't remember if there's four avatars in total. I think I showed this one. I sh there's also a Godzilla one as well, but I don't know if... Yeah, okay, there's also a Godzilla one too. Okay, so there's the Kong one. There's the, there's the permanent castle skin, and you are going to need 16 pieces of the puzzle to get it. I mean, really, it just comes down to RNG. It comes down to how lucky you're going to get, you're going to be. Now, don't rem remember, these, these skins have no stats. They have zero bearing on your war ability in this game. It's just, it's, it's just a gimmick for this event, all right? I mean, everyone's going to want it, of course, but like... It's just crazy that it has no stats. You're going to pay for this, but, but it has no stats. And the thing is, IG, IGG is asking a lot for this. Because RNG is a pain. You're not guaranteed to get this free to play. You're not guaranteed to get this for 20 or 30 bucks. It could cost more than that to get this. Which I think is wrong. And I've said this numerous times. I've said it prior to this event, prior to the other collabs. I'm saying it again now. But they're not listening to anyone in the community. They just, they just keep doing it. So it is what it is, right? Uh, but it's a cool looking castle skin, so... Okay. Anyway, that night is cool looking. If, you, if you're a fan of Godzilla, it's kind of cool looking. And then there's a leader skin. Now, they've put 50 of the portraits here under this massive puzzle with 25 puzzle pieces that you have to collect, which is going to be an absolute ball ache to get all of this. this also, this might change compared to the main server what i mean is this might not be leader skins on the main server it might be an artifact on the main server so wait until tomorrow to confirm what the big prize is this is the taiwan server and sometimes the prizes change it on this thing okay but at the moment it's showing leader skins and we get to look at the leader skin now if you remember from yet yes the other stream the other day I showed you a pre-rendered image of what we believe was the actual leader skin. Which is this this here, this thing here. Now I know you guys were laughing at it, calling it the ghost albino Godzilla, right? But this was the image which I had the other day for you. This is what we looked at. It was like a, a pre-rendered image of, of what we believe was a Godzilla skin. We thought this might be what was going to be put in the game as a Godzilla skin. So let's click on the Godzilla skin and see if we were right or if we were wrong. Okay, here we go. We're about to find out. Were we right or were we wrong? <laughs> I think we were right, guys. <laughs> I think we were right. Uh, yeah, we were definitely were right. This is this is the Godzilla skin. He does a roar. I'm really disappointed that he doesn't light up. That's the animation for the leader skin. Disappointing. I have to say, sorry, IGG, but I have to say disappointing. I would have liked the leader skin. If it's the leader skin animation, considering you're asking for a lot of money for this, I think as a leader skin animation, his whole back should have lit up as part of the leader skin. Then you might have got some Godzilla fans spending for it. But the fact that he just stands there and goes, Rrr! that's literally all he does. There's no light up. There's no fire. There's nothing, man. Like, it's just, it's very basic. It's very basic. Matt in the chat says massive L in the chat. Yeah, I'm not happy with the leader skin. I got to be honest with you guys. I don't like it. I like Godzilla. Trust me, I'm a Godzilla fan. I'm going to go and see the movie straight away. Even before IGG done this, I was going to go see the movie. Absolutely. But the fact that this leader skin is going to be expensive, and I'll show you why in a minute, 
Doesn't even light up. Come on, man. That's a that's a massive L for the leader skin. Um, and again, of course, it's got the same motivated march skill. You know, so there's nothing different there. There is an exclusive avatar as well, which goes with the leader skin. And of course, you know it's got no stats, so it is what it is, right? It's just it's just for the it's just for the looks. But remember, you need 120 of these leader skin fragments to unlock this. So now let's talk about the cost of unlocking it. If you, that's something you want to do, so 50 of these are going to be here. Maybe they might not be. This might change. Subject to change, but at the moment, 50s in there. Let's go and take a look at what's inside the store over here. So again, we've got some collab avatar emotes. These are ones which I showed you on stream the other day. <laughs> we literally exposed everything. They're exactly the same as what I showed you the other day. Godzilla love, Roaring Kong. This is the avatar, which actually looks pretty good. I've got to be honest with you. It, it looks good. I like the avatar. I like it a lot, actually, that one. So that's the Godzilla avatar. It looks pretty cool. Um, and there we get to the artifacts. So we knew the name of the artifacts and I did show you some images the other day and we were trying to work out what they were, etc. right? Well, one of the images I showed you. Give me two seconds, guys. We're getting there. One of the images I showed you the other day was this one here, right? And we were, we were, we were basically talking about it and trying to work out what it could be. This was one of the images I showed you the other day on stream. I thought this might be an artifact. Um, you guys were speculating as to what kind of it, what it could be. Well, were we were we correct? Yes, we were indeed, ladies and gentlemen. We were correct that that is indeed an artifact. There you go. Look, the mantle of treachery is a purple artifact, and we did have the image of it. It was correct, so we we definitely exposed that one. <laughs> Um, and you can see here, this artifact is going to be, let me hide my camera for a second, just so you can see guys. This artifact here is going to be infantry max HP 16% and familiar training level experience 16% on the mantle of treachery. Okay. Now the next image that I showed you the other day was this and the name of the we for the name of their artifact was called the cursed doll and i showed you this on the other live stream the other day so we're gonna see if we were correct on this one and yes we were <laughs> we were correct on that one that is indeed the gold artifact the cursed doll okay so we got that one bang on as well um and the cursed doll let me just move the camera here a sec again the cursed doll is the gold one and it's gonna have range attack 12%, range HP 24%, range HP, which is quite a lot, and cavalry defense. Okay, so that right there is gonna be gonna be the uh, the cursed style artifact. Okay, so there's two artifacts in this in this first this first. Don't get too excited, guys. It's the first of two collab events don't be fooled there's another one coming trust me i'm telling you i'll prove it in a second again but there's another one coming all right so this is the that's the second one as far as anything else goes inside this collab we're going to take a look uh you can see here there's also portrait skins here which they're charging 70 mysterious ore and i mean i guess if you want the avatar and the skin, you have to unlock 100 of them because you need 130 for, 120 for the skin and 130 for the avatar. So if there's 100 here and 50 in the event, in, in the photographing, that's the, that's the skin and the avatar. So it might be that way on the main server, to be honest with you. Either way, if you don't want the, if you want this leader skin, but you don't want the avatar, it's still going to require you to get 70 of these. So that's going to be 70 and the 50 that's in the photographing. So 70 times 70 is for, is it 14,000 or something? I don't know, something like that. Let me have a quick look. Uh, I feel like it's cheaper than the previous collaboration event. I feel like IGG's made it slightly cheaper. I don't know. What do you reckon? 70 times 70. It's 4,900 actually. So yeah, sorry, I've got my, I've got my mass wrong. 4,000, only 4,900. Now, I have to say, if it's, don't forget, it's 4,900 plus what's in the photographing. Now guys, please do me a favor and cast your mind back to the 
previous collaboration event. Not 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 the Pagani one because we didn't we didn't have photographs of the Pagani one. The Shrek event with Puss in Boots and Shrek. I'm pretty sure it was more expensive. We requ we required more on that one. It was Sid. It wasn't four thousand nine hundred on the Shrek one, was it? The Shrek one was like fifteen thousand or something, wasn't it? Or twenty thousand fragments. 20,000 things. I swear it was really high. It was like stupid high. I'm pretty sure it was. I might need to go back and check my stream to really confirm that or not. But I'm pretty sure the Shrek one was 20,000. There it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the Shrek alphas just said it in the chat. During the Shrek collaboration, each of the leader skins for Shrek and for Puss in Boots was, was um, 20,000 each. It was really expensive. 4,900 for this one is what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, 4,900 for this one on, on, on the actual fragments. You need 4,900 to get the skin. But I'm pretty sure it was like 20,000 for the Shrek one. Uh, for, for the Shrek one. If that's the case, if that's the case, right? Then that means maybe I yeah look I AK Bear in the chat guys what's up Bear, IGG learned their lesson that's why they had a severe loss of income and, and as not a lot of people got them so to increase their chance of more profit they lowered it, guys I do believe IGG have lowered it. Now of course it's still going to be pay to play. It's this is still going to be a pay to play item of course, right? But IGG have lowered it by quite a bit. Because I'm pretty sure the Shrek one and the Puss in Boots one were a hell of a lot more expensive. This has been lowered significantly, I think. You can argue maybe still not enough, and possibly that is an argument to be had. But I'm still happy they've made it cheaper. It does definitely seem cheaper, but it, yeah, it also, yeah, I agree with what Mook just said in the chat. It depends on the drop rate as well. Uh, and that's all that's in here. Some speed ups as well. Um, so that's all we have in this particular event. Okay. Let's, 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 let's roll three and see how many we get. I don't know. I'm going to roll these three on Kitty's account just to, uh, just to see what we get. So we're going to find one. Okay. And then number two. Okay. We've got two. Okay. I mean, I don't know. It's hard to tell off two rolls. We, we're going we're to need to get some of these and, and roll it and see how we get on with it, I guess. Here's the prizes. That's what you get inside. So you're going to be getting the fragments for the different puzzle pieces. And then there's a chance of getting 110, 5, 3, and 2. It's still going to cost a fair bit because, I mean, it's going to be 70 per fragment. And you still need 5,000 of them. That's, that's, it's still going to be, a, it's still, it's not cheap. It's still going to cost a fair bit of money. I say it is. Shrek was 65 per shard, so this is 70 per shard. So you're saying this is more expensive. But did you need to did you need to only get a 70 plus what's in the puzzle piece to do it? I don't know. I feel like it's cheaper. But I mean I might be wrong. But I feel like it's cheaper. Either way, it's still gonna be really expensive regardless. Just looking at it. You're gonna, you're gonna need to roll so many of these puzzle pieces. And there's no way to get these. Let's make this very clear. You can't get these things by just playing the game. Which is the most disappointing part about this entire collaboration is that you can't gain these items by playing lords mobile you can't just play the game and unlock these you have to get them by buying things with credit cards you have to swipe 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 it always last 52 months let's go baby thank you for the support man you're an absolute legend on the channel i appreciate 52 month support man wow yeah, it's a full pay to play pro like program I and mean, you're going to get so you're going to pick up some free stuff like you'll get an emote you'll probably get this seven day trial skin you'll probably get like this emote you might get the avatar if you're lucky but as far as getting the castle skin it's going to be very very difficult for free to play to get this without some really good rng not if you're rolling one picture per day you're going to need some insane rng to get that and don't even think about going for the leader skin as free to play it's just not going to happen because like, even if you did some by some miracle, which it probably, I mean, the thing is, there's there's 25 days here. It's only a 30 day event, so you'd have to literally roll a new piece every day. It's impossible. You can't do it free to play. 
And even if you did, some, by some miracle, do it, you wouldn't be able to come in here and buy all the fragments to open the skin up anyway. Because so it's impossible. <laughs> it's impossible free to play. And that's the real difficult. That's the real pain in the ass about all this. I understand maybe if IGG put like some, a price tag behind this. Put a price tag behind the curse style have like, this because this actually affects battle stats. Do you know what I mean, guys? This, if you if you get this, it's going to affect your castle stats. It's going to affect your performance in game. So something like this should have a price tag on it. You should have to pay for this, I think. And the same goes for this one here. I think you should have to pay for the artifacts because they actually add stats. But the gimmicky things for the for the collab, the castle skin, the leader skin, the emotes, they should be available for everybody to enjoy and play around with. And the fact that they put these price tags on these things ruins the whole collaboration experience. So, I mean, to me, it's a massive L because of that reason. Uh, so anyway, that is the that is the collab event. That's what's coming. Um, obviously, guys, just to let you know, everything I showed on stream was pretty much bang on as far as the artifacts, the emotes, the avatars, the leader skins, the castle skins, everything. Yeah. But I want you to be very much aware that this is not the only part of this collaboration. Okay. It's very, very important that you realize that there is going to be another, there's going to be another event halfway through. It's a one month thing, but I, as soon as Kingdom Labor's resets, which is in about two weeks, they're going to drop another one. And I'll show you the image I got because I showed you this image the other day. It's an important image. It basically blows the lid on the second second RNG event. Let me go grab it. Let me go grab it for you guys. All right. Because it's important that you realize this, guys. It, there is more to come. This is not just it. So make sure you don't go crazy blowing your wad on it. You know what I mean? There it is. This is the second, this is the second collab event. It's the image that tells you what's coming. Look. Boom. This right here is the second RNG event that's coming to Lords Mobile as part of this collaboration. And as part of this collaboration here, there's going to be new artifacts, guys. They're going to put new artifacts and probably probably may, maybe another leader skin. I don't know. Maybe the gods, maybe the King Kong leader skin. I would imagine so, right? But like I'm telling you, there's more to come and it's going to include other artifacts, things like this. Potentially. Yeah. Look at these images. These are the images I showed the other day. This could be the new... This, these could be the next two artifacts. This one and this one. These could be the next two artifacts that could be coming along with this next collaboration event. Okay. So, just... Just... All I'm saying is, pace yourself because... If you're buying stuff, just know that it ain't going to be over once you max out this event. There's going to be another one within two weeks that's going to drop. And it's going to have new... Art I think it's going to have new artifacts on it. And it's going to have new stuff on it. There's, I mean, on this one they've showed, there's some of the emotes that I have that are missing. For example. There's like at least three emotes I've got. Four emotes here that are not part of this club event. I'll show you. So... This one here, for example, this isn't part of this collab event. That one, that's not here. Like, I didn't see this one anywhere. Like they've got this, they've got the two of the cartoon ones, but they've, they've held back the other ones. Okay. This is another emote that's coming, but it's not in this part of this, not in this collab event. It's coming in part two. Trust me, guys. I'm telling you now that bang on 100%. This, this emote is coming as part of the next one. And the other one they left out was this one. The orangutan. <laughs> Trust me, that's coming as well. That's coming as well. And the other one they left out was this one. They left this one out with the dots, dot, 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 little side eye from King Kong. They've left this one out as well. This one's not here at the moment. And this one's not here at the moment. All right. So there's at least four emotes which are not being displayed in this current event here, which means there's more to come, okay? There's 100% more to come in this King Kong Godzilla collaboration, including artifacts, emotes, possibly maybe some more avatars. I don't know. I mean, that's all I've got right now. 
but i'm just letting you know that there is more to come so just be warned don't blow it because that then this second event by the way is identical to fiona's kisses it's literally the same thing it's just completely reskinned for king kong godzilla but i guarantee they're going to be putting in some new artifacts in here as well and it's going to cost a fortune to unlock them all because this this i remember from the shrek event this second one was worse than the photographs the photographs was tame compared to how much this thing cost to actually get the stuff done it was insane anybody that's got the puss and boots skin legitimately i'm not talking about an igg account i'm talking about legitimately paid for with their own money to get puss and boots unlocked will know how painful and expensive this shit is and then we've got it all over again within the space of a month a month we're back again doing it again crazy as for me i'm gonna be doing this the, both these events a lot different to how i've done them in the past i won't be spending nowhere near as much on these events as i used to i'm gonna be cutting it back i will try and unlock the artifacts but i will only be taking them to the minimum stars i won't be pushing them to maximum to bless them i'll get the minimum stars that'll probably be two stars maybe three stars but that's about it i won't be spending all my cash on these dumb reskinned events that have zero imagination from a developer that should be doing way better with an amazing ip like kong godzilla i think igg's taken a massive l by just taking on this awesome ip and doing it discredit by not giving it a unique twist a unique event of its own it's absolutely crazy that they've just reskinned a shrek and a shrek event and just made it the same thing just with godzilla kong zero imagination zero effort absolutely awful so it's zero out of ten for imagination and creativity for igg it's just another money spend event for them to make more money off you guys so i'll be passing on this i mean i'm gonna buy i mean they will i will do what i gotta do to try and get the artifacts open because i'd like to get the artifacts at minimum level i'll put books on them and level them up i'm not going to be getting the stars I'm not going crazy on this event. I have no interest in the leader skins because they don't have any stats or any reason for me to unlock. And most importantly, the leader skin looks just dreadful. I mean, the castle skin's the best thing out of all this. I have to be honest with you. Because the leader skin is awful. It just looks unfinished. It just looks unfinished. Like, why does this not light up when the animation comes on? I don't understand how you make this um, Godzilla, right? Not light up when the animation's going on the on the on the front screen like who who comes up with the idea at this so igg to not light this guy up on this leader leaderboard leader screen you know what i mean d -d 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 i just i just don't get it like why do you just make him roar that and it's such a timid roar as well this is godzilla man like what the hell this is godzilla like there should be an Empire State Building as the as the leader skin, and you get to see him like smash into it or something. Or I don't know, not Empire State Building. That's King Kong. But like, there should be like a big skyscraper there, and he should be like blasting out his beam of light or something, and blowing a skyscraper up or something. Or I don't know. If you can't do that, it should all be lit up. There should be fire coming out of his mouth. It should be all lit up. It should look way better than this. This looks like an unfinished, barely rendered version of Godzilla. So yeah, I'm really disappointed with the uh, with the leader skin. Uh, I mean, I definitely won't be pushing to get this thing open. I got no no interest at all. Let's hope the King Kong one looks better. But even then, even if the King Kong one looks loads better than this, it's still going to be tucked behind a pay paywall that's going to be really expensive to unlock. So we can't really even enjoy it anyway unless we're willing to get our credit cards out, which I'm not willing to do, and I bet 99.9% .9 of you guys aren't willing to do either. So really, it's just a massive L. That's all it is. It's just a huge L for IGG. As far as th th this collab goes, so far from what we can actually see that's confirmed, this is the best part of the collaboration. This castle skin does look kind of cool. It's going to be fun seeing all these Godzillas get across the kingdom. And the fact that it has a pretty good animation inside your castle makes it worth unlocking this skin. I, I, I want to unlock this permanently just because I think it's pretty cool. And I think the animation's pretty cool too. Look at that. It all lights up his back and then boom, out comes the fire. That's what the leader skin should have done. And it's no good having it just on the animation before anybody's wondering, oh, what about when you do the animation? Is he going to go up in the sky and all lit up and pink and stuff? I mean, maybe he is. But the trouble is, 
we've got no way to see that because IgG don't give you a demonstration on what that looks like. There's no way to see a demo of what it looks like when you press the button and it goes up in the sky. And I ain't taking the risk to find out. You know, I let somebody else spend their, all their money to work out if it does or not. And then, you know what? I'll enjoy it when I see somebody else do it. I don't give two rats' ass about doing it. So, yeah, there you go. All these collab events is getting in my nerves, says Urinav. Uh, they don't they don't have any good gameplay, and they just open the supermarket of artifacts and skins, I know. What's up, Pinky? How you doing, bro? I'd rather put my money into Legend of Mushrooms, says Time King. How much is the castle skin? I mean, I don't know the exact price, but I would imagine... I don't think IGG's changed much. It's probably still going to cost you probably based on how many you get and how much money it costs to get these things, it's going to cost you over $1,000. Easy. It's going to be over $1,000, guys. Because, I mean, you're going to have to open so many of these to get the amount of ores you need. You need 5,000. It's going to cost you over $1,000 easy. I would be very surprised if someone can do it for less than for less than 1,000. So I'm going to say it's around about $1,000. It could be more, could be less. All depends on RNG. But I'm going to say $1,000. Which is insane. It's just stupid. It's just stupid. Prince, have you made the meme video? No, I haven't got around to doing it, to be honest with you. Uh, so, yeah, real, real, it's a real shame. It's a real shame. Uh, but, you know, it is what it is. You know, it's what, what we knew they were going to do this. I said this before I even got any of the images. That I knew IGG were going to completely mess up this IP. And they've completely messed it up, just as I foresaw. And it's just a real shame to see it. That's all I can say, guys. I'm, I'm heavily disappointed in a lot of this stuff I'm seeing in here. Um, and yeah, I just, I hate them. But I hate have, I hate seeing these massive paywalls against the gimmick stuff. Like, the uh, not necessarily the, the artifacts, but the castle skins, the leader skins. Just everything. You know, the only, the only positive I can see here is there's no $30 avatars. Maybe they learned their lesson from the Pagani event. I bet loads of people bought those, IGG. $30 avatars. Yeah, okay. Um, but you can count the amount of sales on one hand. It's probably some donut that went and done it, right? <laughs> Please spend money on the artifact for the last day. Yeah, no worries, Dimitri. I'll send you my PayPal, bro. You can send over the funds and I'll, uh, I'll, I'll do just that. Absolutely. Uh, the most tragic thing is to know that they actually did the collabs the right way in the beginning. I know. That's the weird part, isn't it? That's the weird part, Monko. Back in the early days, a few years ago, when IGG started doing collabs, they actually done them right. But I don't know whether there's been a change of management over at IGG or what's going on over there, but they've gone from doing collaborations correct to doing them completely wrong. And it's just crazy. Just crazy. It's just crazy. So there you go, guys. That is your first, first of two. Trust me, there's a second one coming. First of two uh, pay-to-play RNG events that are coming as part of this collab. As far as anything else goes, there is nothing else that goes with it. That's it. That's it. Until part two. Part two is either going to come after this event or it will launch during it. I don't know when, but there'll be a part two, 100%. There's, no, there's, there's nothing in the news as far as I can see. I, don't, I can't read that anyway. I don't know if they're going to do something in the news with it, like a little event, side event with it or anything. Based on what I'm seeing, all it is, is just a pay-to-play RNG event. There's no new heroes or anything. I've already checked. I mean, that nah, that's it. That's it, guys. I know. That's it. That's the collab. A pay-to-play RNG event. That's it. The imagination that that must have took must have been insane. Mines must have been blowing over at IGG headquarters. Crazy. Collabs when they first came out really were good. Now they are just horrible. If everyone boycotts, they will change their ways. But it has to be everyone not to spend on this event. You sure part two is only 30 days? Don't know. Because the last one they done, they, re they reduced the time, didn't they? They gave us like 30 or 45 days on the first collab. And then they gave you like 25 days or something on the second one. They gave you like hardly any time to finish it because they wanted to squeeze people more. That's all they're doing with these events right now is just squeezing people. It's just ridiculous. Uh, Panic Banana says, I wish we get a normal event with normal castle skins and normal stats, which can help also help free to play or spend 30 bucks and get it instant, but not that stupid money. 100% agree with you. 
Canis says, more insulting is the guild exp expeditions, 70 euro passes if you want them all. Yeah, bro, I'm not even buying them this time around. I've made a decision. I'm not even going to be buying the guild expedition passes this time around. I'm not even going to buy the silver one. I'm not going to buy any of it. I'm not spending no money on guild expedition this go round. I'm just going to go in there, do my gathering, do my dark nests, and I'm going to get out of there. And that's it. I'm not... I'm not doing anything with it. I'm totally not paying any money, any more money now into that event. I'm done. I'm done with that, guys. Um, Keaton says expedition time reduced, a little bit less. Yeah, it has, but that's not good enough, unfortunately. The event is still completely unplayable until they make the healing like dragon arena and they change up the point system so that it is based on duration of, duration of time held on faults as opposed to who's holding at the end because that doesn't give anybody any motivation to fight at the start of the event you just wait until like four or five hours before the end and then you go take everything and then you, you win that's it so they need to change the point system but even if they change the point system it's not going to work until they do they change the fundamental issue that's been in this event since it arrived on the beta server before it even got to the main server which is the healing it needs to be like da everyone's been saying it in the community everyone has been saying the healing needs to go igg know about this but they refuse currently as of yet to make the change that is going to make this event playable instead they reduce by 50 percent and we still need to be um, you know negative towards that we're happy they're sort of in a way listening but we need to be negative in the sense that we need them to change it to make it like da because as it sits right now the event is unplayable TWK will not be participating in this event until it's changed correctly. And it's not just us that's not doing it. We haven't participated in this event since the first one. I played the first one just for you guys, just so we could see a bit of action and play it for the first time. But that was it. Since then, we've not participated and we will not participate until IGG make the correct changes on this event. And I know a lot of other guilds are doing that as well. So there you go. That's that one. Um, it's 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 another massive L for IGG. Like they've they've known for weeks, months now that this event needs to be changed, and they still haven't done it. It's crazy. You wish they made kills real. I don't even care about kills. Like I'm not even I'm not even a kill snob. I don't even care about kills at this point. They could put kills in there. I'll still be pissed. I'll still want the healing gone. Sorry, but nah. It's just you, this this this. There should be no healing in that. It's an event. It should be fun. It shouldn't cost money. It's bullshit. That's what it is. It's bullshit, guys. All right? So we won't be playing that. No, it's a no-go. I only go in to gather RSS and leave. So do I, Kevin. We do rallies in Expedition first phase to kill all NPCs and share points. And that's our Expedition. Yeah, I mean, it's just it's just an L. It's a huge L. Um, Okay, so that's that done. There's nothing else really to show you on here, guys. That's all it is. Another money grab rng event the castle skin looks pretty cool but beyond that the leader skin is awful uh, and if anything the leader skin should have been the one that all lit up and had fire coming out of its mouth at least make it good for the people that spend all that money to get it but just like passively walking with a little uh, like it's just, <laughs> it's, just, it's just absolutely awful man it's terrible it's really bad so there you go and do these appear in here now unobtained artifacts i'm assuming they would be right yeah 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 yeah. there's one there the purple one's there and the gold one where's the gold one? Oh, the gold one's not even there that's weird this one showed up here but the gold one's not there oh huh. wonder why the gold one's not showing up that's weird hmm. okay okay A solo trap update can I show the leader skin? Yeah, I can show you missed it. Obviously missed it in earlier on the stream. Yeah, I can show you quickly. It looks terrible. It's so bad, man. It doesn't even light up. I'll, I'll, let, I'll let the animation go. Watch the animation. Here comes the animation. Look. That's the animation. That's the animation right there. That little roar. That's it. I need some glasses. No, I like drinking out of the bottle. Yeah, yeah I mean, that, you know what I mean? He's yawning. He looks like he's yawning. Yeah, look, it's a yawn. 
I think Godzilla's I think Godzilla's just just as bored of IGG's collab events than we are. He's probably walking along thinking, what the fuck am I doing here? What the fuck's going on? Why am I here? Why am I here stuck in this dumb game? Oh, get me the hell out of here, man. You know what I mean? He's he's bored shitless. Look at him. He wants to he wants to go do some fighting. He don't want to stand there like some lemon. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah, it's terrible, man. It's so bad. Anyway, unfortunate, innit? Yo, what's up, Mixy? You, WP, you a bit blind. The gold artifact is there. Was it there? Am I completely blind? Oh, yeah, it's there. <laughs> I'm blind as a bat. I do apologize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's there. Okay, it's there. So, none of the other artifacts that are going to be coming out are there yet. But they, they won't. They're, they're, they're going to wait until, obviously, the next, the next RNG event drops. Okay. Um, chest event on Mushroom Game. Okay, cool. Let's jump over to Mushroom Game quickly and finish off on that today. Um, but that's basically everything you need to do you know, to, you know, on the club event, all right? Don't forget to smash the like button, please. And thank you for supporting. I appreciate it, guys. For those of you that are going to disappear now, I uh, love you guys. Thank you for supporting, man. I'm happy to, happy to bring you the news as always. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and jump onto Mushroom Game quickly. Uh, because, um, hang on, two secs. I've got to work out. I've got to work out how to do all this. I think I've got it bang on now. Um, there we go. And get that done. And click on this. There we go. And then. Uh oh. Oh. Yep. I just need to read. I just need to resize it. Shit. Oh, I can't do it. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna have to do it like that. I'm trying to see the screen. I can't see the screen. Oh, that's fine. That's not. That's fine. There we go. And then I can bring chat over. You know, that's the good thing about this. I can always bring chat. I like, I like doing the portrait games because I can bring chat over. There you go. Me two seconds. I'm just adjusting things. There you go. Cool. All right, give me a second, guys. I need to jump over and do this chest event. Have I missed it? Oh no, 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 there's, there's, no. Go, 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 go. Let me get these chests. Morbid is insane. Morbid's boosting like crazy. What, is there any more? One here. There's one down there as well. I got my plane though. Look, I unlocked my plane last night. Let me grab that. Yo, Family Brawl's coming as well. I'm going to stream that. I don't know what it is, but I'm going to stream it. Oh, the round changed. Go down, go down, go down, go down. Got two more I can get. Let's have a look. Here we go. Last one. Boost the little troops today. Okay. You're level 65. <laughs> okay, that's that done. Uh, someone's robbing my plants. What the hell? Yo! Who's this dude? No! Yo, Morbid, get out of my garden, you twat! Yo, I'm gonna message him on Discord. I'm gonna ring him. I'm ringing him. I'm calling his ass. Yo, 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 yo. Yo, I'm calling him right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna kick his ass. Yo, where 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 where's where's my Discord thing? Yo, fuck. I'm calling his ass right now. Yo! Hey! Yo! Oh. Yo! Yo! Get out of my garden, bro! What? Get out of my garden, bro! You thieving my plants! You've been offline six hours, man. Someone else already stole your other shit. Get out of my garden! Take all your skills and take all your pets off. I'm gonna fight you. You gotta take all your skills and all your pets off. 
that's like that's a lot of work, man. Do it. Do it. You're not getting my plants. Get out of my garden, bitch. Take a <laughs> take all your pets off and take all your skills off. I'm gonna deck you. You're gonna deck me? You're so far away. How are you gonna deck me? You gotta take all your skills and all your plant all your pals off. Minus them all off, so I can hit you. I can't, cause you can't pull, you can't, you can't withdraw. So I got, I got to knock you off. I was like, all yeah. right, try it. All right, I'm gonna do it now. We're gonna kick his ass, boys. He took all his pals off, so there's no way I'm gonna lose. There you go. Oh my god, he's so tanky. Look how much HP he's got. What the hell? Yo, he's got no skills and he's got no pets and he's kit. Yo, how are you doing damage to me with no pets and no skills? Because I still have all my basic attacks and everything. And I still have 7.5 thousand power. Bro, you're actually, you're actually killing me. Hang on a second. Oh, I won. I won. I skipped it. Get out of my garden. That's what you get. <laughs> to be fair, chat, if he had his skills on, he would have killed me in like two seconds. He would he would have got me in like two seconds if he had his skills on. Morbid, have you got any blue gear yet? No, level twenty lamp. Oh, are you are you not close? Uh, I'm about to have my second bar. Ooh, that's actually really good, bro. And then I've got to still get another three on top of that. Ooh. Close, mate. Close. Um, mm -hmm. man, thanks, for, thanks for letting me kill you. I'm not, I'm not going to be able to do that again for a while. Mm -hmm. I'm actually about to upgrade my lamp now, actually, to level 18. Well, actually, I'm not upgrading it now. It's going uh, to... I ain't got enough speed ups, I don't think. I've got 100... Yeah, that's not enough. That takes it by nine hours. I might as well just let it tick away rather than waste my speed ups. It's gonna take 21 hours for me to get to the next lamp level. Uh, anyway, chat, this is how my account's looking right now. We are full pink gear right now, which is kind of cool. And I managed to upgrade my mount to the uh, sky glider. Uh, so that was cool. Um, obviously I've got to work on the stars now to upgrade this to get to the next one. I didn't know you were streaming. I am, yeah, yeah, yeah. How many stars have you got on your sky glider? My sky glider? On your the mount? mount? Yeah, oh, the, 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 the plane. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two away. Eight. Oh wow, that's a lot. Damn. Um What does R and G mean? Oh no, it's not R and G. <laughs> it's R N G. R and G. I say N N N. R -N -G. Random number generator. Yeah, yeah, that's that's it. Yeah, random number generator. It basically means luck. Gacha. Um, if I've got ten numbers, one to ten, and I say, put your hand in there and pick a ball out. It's going to have a number on it between one and ten, and you need to get number seven. It's going to be R and G, depending on if you're going to get number seven or not. It's random. It's random generate. So it's loot boxing, basically. It's gacha. So when you get something you want, when I roll, which I'm going to do in a minute, if I roll and get something I really need, then I had good RNG because I had good luck, basically. That's basically what it means. Tonight we get Sword and Family Brawl. I don't know, do we? There is a new event that popped up. I did notice it yesterday. There's a new event that popped up in here. Um, let's go and have a quick look. It's over here. There's a portal that appeared, appeared over here. I have no idea what it is. It says, oh, I already signed up. It's going to start in four hours, 51 minutes. I'm going to record it, I think, and then post a video tomorrow. Um, but it says here that there's different group, current group results. And then exchange, you could get rewards. So you get these like badges, family battle points. And then you can come in here and get stuff like there's pink skills in here. Look at that. But that's 12,000. I'm assuming it's going to take a lot to get 12,000 if there's pink skills in here because these are really valuable. But there's pink skills in here. There's also Red Soul Selection 1. Select the soul from basic attack combo. 
Okay, I have no idea what that is. Used to unlock the, some accessories. That's just basically cosmetics. Those are cosmetics. Random purple soul. I have no idea what souls do. Yeah, I have no, I no idea what souls do. There's also re draconic resonance shards. Like, there's some weird shit in here. I don't know what half this stuff does. Anyway, it's probably good stuff that you need. But I don't know what family brawl is. I'm guessing it's one family versus another family. I have no idea, but it's going to be interesting nonetheless. It'll be us versus Uwu, probably. Or it might be, I don't know if it's server yep. versus server. Do you think it's server versus server, Morbid? Say what? Do you reckon it's going to be server versus server, or do you reckon it's going to be like us versus another guild inside our own server? Uh, I don't think it's going to be server versus server yet. I think no. it's going to be everybody on our server. Okay, it's probably going to be. It's probably going to be us versus Uwu, you know that. Or Dark Souls, one of the two. Hmm. Or it could be RNG and we get some low podunk people. If we get a low guild, they're going to get squashed. Uh, if we get Uber, we might lose because they've got more depth, didn't they? But they're saying that you'll probably kill everyone, wouldn't you? I mean, that's what's been happening. <laughs> He's just been killing everybody. Um, how to do on damage? Fifth. Ooh, fifth. Damn. Oh, I didn't have all my attack skills on this one. Okay. Wow, Smelly Dog's in third place now. Ooh. Yeah, I didn't have all my attack skills on. I was still set up because I was doing the campaign. I'm stuck on the campaign at the moment. Until I'm tonight. on Apocalypse 8, 4-6. Ooh. I'm on Apocalypse 5, 4-1. I'm stuck on this right now. I can't get past it at the moment. <laughs> um... Hopefully we're not getting shrooms too. <laughs> no, right? We don't want to hurt the other guild. Um, okay, let me go ahead and check my mail. Oh, hello. Ooh. Yo, I, do you know what to do with these hammers? Divine hammer used to refine artifacts. Like, how I do think you once you get your artifacts leveled up to a certain level, I think you got to use uh, the hammers to be able to kind of like... Um, Mythic grade, I'm like from Lords or something is what I'm feeling like. Yeah, but those, those, re they're relics. They're not artifacts. They're relics. Oh, yeah. Okay. Then the artifacts could be, uh, day six. Day six. They could, you know, you know, next to, next to the mount, there's like a rectangle square. Maybe that could be the artifact. Yeah. Day six. That'd be tomorrow. And then we have it? something, and then we have something coming on day 15, too. Oh, by the way, I know that, you know, when you go, if you click on the, um, if on the left hand side, if you click on the gold crown, you know, you have level rush and player rush. Yeah. Yeah. There's another one coming and the next one's called mount rush. So basically you're going to be leader score leadable points for who's leveling up their mount the most. So I would maybe save all of your, well, I wanted to get to the plane. I done that, but now I'm saving all of my little key cogs. I get, I'm saving all my gems now as well. And I'm waiting for that Mount Rush thing so we can actually push it once that Mount Rush thing comes out. Because that's going to be that's gonna be good. Yeah, artifacts might be today. It could be the star thing. Yeah, it could be. That says day 15, though. Look, when you click on it, it says day 15. That's quite a way away yet. We're only like four days into the server. Day five is... Or five days into the server. Tonight's day six reset. So I think it's this. It says day six. Look. Coming soon. Feature not yet unlocked. So... Uh, great novel in the chat says loving that the shroom game the 400 pound costume event worries me though for future events true hopefully they don't get as greedy as igg in the long run yeah so they brought out this um this is a new event that came out yesterday called star dream party um you can see here it says guaranteed in 500 draws now i've done 44 and that's because i've done it completely free to play um, I claimed all of the uh, these tokens, so I've done it completely free to play and got all these, and that's as far as I could get free to play. And I unlocked a bunch of stuff, but I didn't get the keys and I didn't get the pajamas. Okay, um, so to get that, you need to now buy packs. So there is a pay event here, pretty much. I mean, it's, there is. I like the fact they included a bunch of free to, free to play stuff because I was able to unlock a bunch of really cool items that I needed. 
like loads of gold, rocks for research, speed ups and tickets and fertilizer. Like I got a bunch of really good stuff from it, but not enough to, I didn't have the RNG, the luck to get, I guess, to get that. But it does say limited reward guaranteed within the next 56 draws. So every 100, you're guaranteed to get a limit reward, which will be the keys, the cats, or that costume. You probably got to spend 500 to get the costume. But like, the, this is this is the packs here. It's, you can see it's like 130 tokens for 100 bucks. So if you've got like, it's, it's not quite 500. You probably spend maybe like three would get you like one, two, three, 390. And then maybe a 70 would be like 460. Yeah, so it's, it's like 350 to get there. It's not four, it's not $500 because you do 44 free to play and then spend another 350 and you can probably unlock everything. So it's it's a, it's a cosmetic for your hero. Well, if, in essence, it's a leader skin. That's pretty much what it is, isn't it? It's a hero skin. So it's a hero. It's a hero skin and it's going to cost $350 to actually unlock. And the thing is, not only are you going to get the leader skin, you're also going to get a top end red power as well. You're also going to get these keys to level up your mount and a whole bunch load of speed ups, gold tickets, all sorts of shit. So it's, you're getting quite a lot. It's not just that. Plus, there's also these claim items down the bottom here. There's hammers, there's diamonds, there's keys. There's all sorts of stuff here for you to claim as well. So there's a bunch of rewards here. That's the drop rates. So the drop rates are there. You've got a 2.25% chance of getting the premium rewards just by spinning. 33% chance for the rare rewards. 64% chance for the other things. And these aren't terrible either. These are for research, speed ups. Gold is good. So yeah, I mean, like the rewards are pretty good. Um, The was starting. Raid, the raid's starting soon. I've already done it today, haven't I? Let me go check. It starts at 1925. It says already obtained today. I've already done it today. How long till it starts? Let me go take a look. I don't mind helping you guys though. Eight minutes. Okay, cool. I'll come back in eight minutes. Um, go ahead and click that. I've already done my dailies today. I've done it this morning. I'm going to open these lamps up and see if I get any drops. Do a bit of RNG. I've only got 489. It's not a lot. Nothing on that one. This one? Ooh, we've got an orange one. Nice. Upgrade these. All right, sweet. Let's open up these lamps and see if we get anything good, guys. I don't stop it unless it's pink. If it ain't pink, I don't want to know. See if we get a good drop. I don't know. I've only got only got 450. It won't take two stages. You got your first red skill today. Nice. You guys have a loads of pink gear. Yeah, we've been grinding. <laughs> we've been grinding like crazy the last few days. It's been nuts. Alright. Do I have enough food, by the way, to go and do a worship? I don't know if I have or not. I do. I can do two. Okay, so as you can see. I've been rolling this. Okay, the way this works, just in case for those of you that don't understand how this works, right? You go to the farm, you grow the food, right? And then when you got the food, you bring it to the statue and then you basically offer it as an offering to the god, right? The mushroom god. And then you basically re-roll the stats. Now, if I take all these open, it only costs 100 food to spin it, but then it's going to be risky because you're going to lose the A grades. The highest grade is S. I haven't got an S one yet, all right? It's oh, no, there's one. What? There's higher ones. What, than S? Yes. What's, you sure? What's the highest? What's higher than S? You get SS and you get SSS. Go oh, click damn. on the little explanation point. Where? Oh. On that statue. Oh, damn. And when you hit level five, you won't get anything under a B grade. Oh, so it might be worth saving the food, right? Oh, you got to use the food to level up, though, haven't you? Yeah. All right. Anyway, it's okay. We're gonna go ahead and do two now. See if we can upgrade this D. So this is the this is. It's gonna be hard for me to re-roll two of mine. I oh, can re-roll so the other three. Oh, it's the probability of getting it. So I can't even get S yet because 
it's a 5%. I've got 0% chance until I get to level 4. But I've got 4 A's though. I've got 4 A's, which is really good. So I need to get A roll. I need to basically get an A roll on this bottom one. Okay, let's see if we get it. Alright, C, C's not bad. C's good. We've got to go again though, because I need to I need to feed the statue. Alright, it stays at C. Okay, that's fine. I haven't got enough food to go again. But at least I upgraded it, so that's good. I want to try and yeah. Oh, okay, I see. I see now. Okay, that makes sense. All right, cool. So you have to, you, but you have to feed it to level the statue up. So it's nearly at level four, and then I can try and go for some S ones. Okay, cool. I didn't get nothing from my lamps, unfortunately. Let's go around. I am over here. Let's have a look. Uh, I got that. Okay. Round two. What is this? Use for oh, there's round two of this. Oh. 25,000. Okay. Oh, nice. I love doing this. I've done this in the last one because like you do this, right? And you get 10,000 of these relic shards. So you can upgrade your relic. It's really kind of good. Morbid's obviously bought some because he's up to third place now. <laughs> I'm down at 17th. I haven't really bought any of the packs yet. I bought like two, the cheap ones. I got the $1 and the $5, but there's more. I haven't bought them yet. <laughs> yet. Yeah, not yet. No, we're not doing it yet. I'm just chilling. I'm not going too crazy, guys. I've already boosted a fair bit as it is. Four and a half minutes to raid. Okay. We'll do the raid. We'll do the raid. It's pretty straightforward stuff. I showed this on yesterday's stream. We raided this thing. Do, 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 do. By the way, these presents I'm opening, these are not from people buying packs. These presents are basically when you clear, when you do a certain, when you, when you get to a milestone in the game, you get the ability to gift your alliance gems. So you can see here that this person in our guild, Adian, uh, done something and he gifted a gift box. And Morbid here, look, com com just completed Apocalypse 7. So he dished out another one with some gems on it. So we grabbed some gems. That's pretty good. I haven't got any at the moment. I've gifted mine all out. Uh, we're all a bit stronger now, so we should get to a higher level, hopefully. Got my first pink, but I don't like pink. <laughs> um, I, I created this myself yesterday. I looked at my phone on power saving mode and thought I was an hour late. <laughs> nah, you're good, bro. Uh, what's, your pro what's, what's on your prayer statue, Mike? Yeah, I just showed you. I just showed you that. Um, you got your first red skill today, says Dylan. Nice. That's very good. Maybe they will see the lack of purchases for it and change the system. Maybe. I think I think they should let the guild have gifts when you buy stuff, but they don't do that, unfortunately. It's just when you do milestones, when you actually play the game. Which I guess in a way isn't a bad thing, right? So, I mean, it's not necessarily a bad thing. So, Morbid, what, what level is your lamp? You're at 19, aren't you? Currently. Morbid. Alright, he's not here. He's at 19 at the moment. So he's going up to 20 soon. And he'll be at once he gets to 20. I can show you the percentage actually. I've got a picture of it. I'll show you. Hold on, two secs. Morbid sent me a picture yesterday. Give me a second, I'll show you. All right, yeah. I can show you the percentage drop that you get on lamp, lamp 20. Give me two secs.
No bell, man. This image was massive. I need to use a resize it. Oh my God. How big is this image? There we go. Right, chat. This is the uh, this is the level twenty lamp. There you go. That's where Morbid's at right now. He's upgrading his lamp. Uh, from oh, there you go. We're finding the fish. <laughs> uh, we'll go back to that in a sec. That's the that's the percentages on it. So once he get, he's at nineteen lamp right now, and he's going up to level twenty. You can see that he's unlock. He's going to unlock Supreme Gear, but the drop rate is 0.015% for Supreme. Yeah, it's crazy, man. <laughs> it's a low drop rate on level 20 lamp for sure. Uh, but he's going to potentially start dropping Supreme Gear soon because he's almost at level 20 lamp. So that's really good. That gives you an idea of uh, the drop rate once you get there. It's going to be it's going to be difficult to get it for sure. All right, so this is the raid boss that happens every day. I thought it was going to be a once a week thing or something. This is a raid boss that happens every day. And every time it comes, it gets more difficult. So, so far, we've killed five of these. We're up to Grumpy Big Head number six. And uh, yeah, you get rewards for doing it. Now, I might get some rewards tonight. I don't know. I've done it this morning. You can only get rewards normally from this for doing it once per day. You don't get rewards for doing it both times. Um, but saying that, I swear I got something last night when I did it a second time. So we'll see. Have we got a Discord for this yet? No, we've got a line group at the moment. I haven't got a Discord set up for this yet. If you want to get into the line group, just message tabs in game. And she'll send you a message. She'll sort it out for you and get you in. Uh, the rest of the screen you guys can't see. That's the rest of my screen there, you can see. I just I just do it so you get more of a bigger screen. All you can see, what, what I'm cutting out at the bottom is my skills. You don't need to see that. Ralph made the screen a little bit bigger for you. We've just been we've just we've just been using the WoW Discord for talking about the game. Yeah, true. How many servers are there? They've actually opened up um quite a few servers. Um, Illic. There's like in the last five days, I think they've opened up like 25 servers or something or 30 servers. That's just on the English. There's more on German and French and other ones as well. But I think there's quite a few. There's quite a few. Ser Oops. That's power save mode. Is that you just got your first pink. Let's go, Remy. Nice. Very nice. Uh, yeah, no, the ser there's, there's quite a few servers. There's quite a few servers, man. It's. I think they had something like five or six million pre-registrations or something. I know it hit number one across all the app stores. Like, everybody's playing this game right now. Like, every <laughs> loads of people playing this game right now, peeps. Oh, Morbid left the call. I thought he was still in the call with me. That's weird. He must have had to go and do something. Um, yeah, he just disappeared. Okay, no worries. Uh... I had an image actually that I was looking for. Let's go and find it. Oh, here you go. I found it on the Discord. Okay, so on the on. Th okay, hang on a minute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it says here, it says limited time event open. Put on the dinosaur costume. Let's party. The costume, the star dream party. That's what's up right now. Um, and then it says artifact, chaotic warlord's hammer. You can get that between the sixth and seventh day after the server opens. So that's what the next event's going to be that's going to be coming out. The artifact's going to be available after the sixth, uh, basically tonight when it on reset in about five hours. There's going to be an artifact available called the chaotic, the chaotic warlord's hammer. Okay, cool. So that's happening tonight. 
But yeah, no, I mean, I, I would I would say, guys, it's definitely worth giving this a go because it's a, it's, it's a fun game. I haven't got any links for you or any codes or anything because unfortunately, I haven't got a sponsorship for this game. <laughs> Uh, I know I, I, it is what it is. I, I tried. I, I, I reached out, but as of yet, I haven't had a reply. So I guess it is what it is. We're just going to keep playing and enjoying the game, to be honest with you. I, mean, I don't always play games because of sponsorships. Uh, it would have been nice, but it is what it is, right? Uh, this was an image they had in their Discord. Just showing you that. You can see, like, literally number one on all the app stores, which is kind of crazy. Crazy man, like, this is on Apple, Apple, I, it's an Apple App Store, Play Store, App Gallery, and what's the other one there as well? Oh, the Galaxy Stores. It's available Galaxy Store, App Gallery, Google Play, and App Store. It's on all the, it's on all the apps, all the app stores. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, so yeah, it was number one. Pretty cool stuff. Hmm. You're stuck in Apocalypse too. <laughs> it's, oh yeah, Apocalypse is no joke. It's quite difficult. Are you still alive, Hastanet? Are you not dead? We're at level 14. We're going to get to level 15 this time. Shrooms 2, Grumpy is level 10. That's good, though. That's good. It's because we got Morbid over here. He's like mega strong. Makes sense. We killed level 13 with 550 left. So I was confused by the time there was. Oh, okay, okay. I died. I was in the front row. Oh, Nathan. <laughs> Yo, you know, it, I haven't died yet in this. Fingers crossed. I haven't died yet. If you guys have the artifact yet. No, it comes out tonight on tonight's reset in about four and a half hours. In about four and a half hours, we'll have it. Not yet. Free to play Yoshi down once again. Oh, it's all good though, bro. You're in the back row cam, still standing. I'm still standing better than I ever did. <laughs> Looking like a true survivor. <laughs> Looking like a little kid. Oh man, I love Phil Collins. Uh, why don't you make some details in your Instagram profile? Um, I don't know, I just started using it. I just started using it. I only started using it the other day. I posted a few pictures, posted a video of a concert I went to the other night. I ain't really an Instagram pro, to be honest with you. You're in the back row as well, Paul Ryan. Are we protecting you, are we? Okay. Cool, cool, cool. I actually got the wrong skills on because I put my mushroom shield and my healing thing. And for this, I don't need both of those. I could have just got away with the healing thing. And I didn't need the mushroom shield, really. It is what it is, though. Are we going to get to level 16, though? Mmm, I don't know. I think yes. I think we're going to get to level 16. Maybe. You're dead. Oh, no. Mm. You lasted almost eight minutes, though, Heston. It. So that's actually pretty good, bro. Come on, guys. Use your mushroom powers. Take out this big fish. Let's go. We're going to get to level 16 this time. I'm telling you, we're going to get to level 16 for sure. 100%. 100% we're getting to level 16. Come on. We can do it. I think so. I think we're going to get 16. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're after 100%. Cam, I can't remember if I've done all my dailies today on World of Water. I think I did them this morning. I think I'm good till tonight's reset, to be honest. Level 12 for the Worthy Shrooms too. Nice. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Yeah. So in case you guys didn't know, we had to set up a second guild because we didn't have enough space. <laughs> So we literally filled up two guilds when we start when I when I started playing this and told you guys to come play. I was like, "Yo, come on, guys, come play the mushroom game." Loads of you downloaded it, and we had so many people. We had to build two guilds rather than one because we didn't we didn't we didn't have enough people. We, we, we needed more people. It was insane. Um, and yeah, I think Worthy Shrooms Two is also pretty much full now, isn't it? Crazy. There we go. That's gonna do it. Come on, level sixteen. Almost there. Yeah, we got it. We got it, I think. Pretty close, but I think we got enough to... There it is. Level 16. Let's go. Nice. Well done. Getting stronger, peeps. Getting stronger. 
Every time we do this, we're getting to a new level. That's really good. Man, if we had another couple of minutes, we'd probably, probably get to that 17, to be honest with you. Who's 16 halfway to 17 in the world chat? Sixteen halfway to seventeen. Uwu. Oh, okay, so Uwu are actually just ahead of us by only a smidge. It's not bad. That's actually not bad because Uwu's got a few bigger, more bigger. We've got the biggest player on the server, but they've got a few big ones. They've got more big ones than we have, so they're doing a bit more damage. Oh, you do get rewards. Oh, it's the first kill rewards because it's the first time we've done a level six. Oh, I see. So yeah, it's worth doing both because you get rewards for both. That's pretty cool. I got fourth on damage. And that and that's because I had the one of the wrong skills. <laughs> that's why I'm blaming that. But it's okay, I'll take fourth. I beat Terra, so that's all that matters, right? Alright, nice, nice. So what you do is again, you get more rewards when you do it for the first time. But obviously right now I just got that. Go to the family shop and you can use these tokens in the family shop to get free things. So I am going to grab lamps. Why not? Let's grab some lamps. I'm going to grab magic lamps. I'm going to try and upgrade my gear. There you go. Another hundred. Nice. Cool. Got a bunch of magic lamps. So all these people you see here, this is the this is basically the guild that you can see here. This is everybody in my in my, in our guild. And if they've got a green light on next to their name, you could, that's because yeah, they're actually online right now looking at that screen. <laughs> Just bought like 350 lamps my tokens. Yeah, I got some too. I got uh 250. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and use these and see if I get anything. I need some upgrades. I need I need some pink. I need to upgrade like this level 77 pink, 79 pink, 83 pink. I'm level 91, so I need some level 91, 92 pink drops, 93 pink drops or something like that. I got this earlier, which is kind of nice. Level 93 hat with insane stats on it. This was kind of nice. Um. Let's see if we get it. I've only got 257. I doubt it. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe something will drop. Maybe something will drop. Just evolved to Axe Warrior. Oh, you're going for the Axe Warrior. I haven't seen too many people do Warrior. Nice. Morbid number one. Flieger number two. Smelly Dogs number three. Yep. Yeah, you need to get the lamps. You need to... The lamps are good not just for gear, but you get experience. You get gold. Um, so yeah, lamps are, lamps are good. I would say, especially early game, you need to be getting, you need to get your experience up. You need the experience, you need the gold. Leveling this lamp up is really important early game. And then later on, and as you get up a bit, once you get to level 10 or level, no, level 12, once your lamp goes to level 12, then you really want to start leveling your skills and powers up a bit more. But you need the, in the start, you need to focus on the lamp and, and straight away. Okay. Uh, let's go and look at these research. How are we doing? 73 pickaxes. All right. Now, what I'm doing here, this is to do with the research. So the research, you have to come into here and you have to mine the ore that you need to do the research with, okay? So let me grab... It's like they've basically made a mini game out of it. Uh, let me grab... Oh, what's up with that? Go down. Oh, there's loads over there. I don't go out of my way too much, though. Ooh, that's loads.
Nice. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You find these ones, loads hit. Nice. Gold is really good. You find gold, it's quite a lot. There we go. Grab that. Nice, that's pretty good. At reset, I'll be getting two drills for free. I'll get 30 pickaxes for free. I'll get two bombs for free every reset. And they, your axes come back over time anyway. Like I left it all day while I was out of the cinema. I come back at about 70 pickaxes. So you just got to wait for your axes to come back. Um, do you save the chest that appears for like two hours? Yeah, sometimes. Sometimes. Um, okay, so now I've got my things. I can go in here and do some research. This is where I'm at right now. I'm working on this uh, HP research over here. So I'm going to hit this one. There we go. Nice. A third of the way now through that research, which is pretty good. Massive stats off this thing. It's going to help me try and get through some of these levels I'm stuck on because I need the extra HP. Um, I don't think I can. Can I? Is it worth doing this? Maybe. It's only lettuces. Lettuces ain't worth that much. Do you, do you get good drops? I notice if you do sometimes. What else can you? What else can you use good for? Gold. Oh no! You use gold for the lamp. That's what you use gold for. Just the lamp. Touch nothing but the lamp. Yeah, it's just it's just the lamp, bro. played a game like this and if it's the same which i'm sure it is there will be future ranking events for things like using the digging material for yeah you, you you're probably right jamie you're probably right there probably will be they seem to do that they seem to put events out which require you to do stuff like use the lamp or level rush mount rush growing rush which there's a plant rush on right now as well it's like farming rush so yeah it wouldn't surprise me if they did something like that for sure okay Picking my plants from. I'm just growing plants right now. Here we go. And 168. Uh, I ain't got much left of our five. Yeah, I can do that one. Okay, let's use that. I've got a good one here. Like, I've got legendary there. That's nice. Uh, I've got a gold one. Nice. It's just the cabbages I don't want. The cabbages are annoying. Ah, oh, common. <laughs> Chinese cabbage. Great. I've got three good ones, though. All right, sweet. So not, not enough to go and roll again, but that's good. And also, I like stealing off people as well. Camazon. Oh, no. What are we doing, Camazon? <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> I don't care if it's family either, because better I get it than somebody else. So we'll grab it. If I see, if I see things, I'll grab them. Falcon Gamer not yet joined a family. Oh, no. I'm gonna go and steal his as well. <laughs> I got my little thief mushroom out. Let's go. Love it. This guy's got some as well. Oh, he's got two big legendaries. Look. Oh. Okay, we're gonna have to go and get those after. <laughs> um, let me see if I can do this boss. I'm stuck on this boss, man. It's actually really difficult. Hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I don't know if I'm going to do it or not. I just don't find... I need more damage. I ain't doing nowhere near enough damage. And he's killing me so hard. Or maybe... Maybe, 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 maybe. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need another shield. Come on, come on, come on. He's, he's going to... Oh, no. If he crits me, I'm dead. Oh, it was so close! Oh, my God! Okay. Jeez. All right. Let me try and time this a bit better. Hold on. Oh, shit. I pressed the wrong button. Ah, just kill me, bro. Just kill me. I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the wrong button. Oh, my God. I messed it up. Saying that, though, my life is doing... Oh, no, here it goes. Oh, he just crit me as well. Oh, oh double, cr double crits on me. Oh, no. Oh, we're going down. He critted me so hard. Like, you know what? There's also a little bit of RNG on fighting these bosses as well. Like, sometimes you'll win, sometimes you'll lose. A lot of it comes down to RNG. 
of who gets the crits and who don't and stuff like that. All right, let me try and do this again. Here we go. All right, one, two, three, four. Wait, 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 wait. Shield. Wait, wait, wait. Now, go. All right, let's see. Let's see if I can. Let's see if I can do it. It's gonna depend if he crits on me. If he crits on me, I'm gonna be in trouble. Counter strike, nice. Okay, I get another counter strike combo attack. Counter strike, good. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Shields up. I got a water thing coming in just a second. That's gonna freeze him for a few seconds. I've got, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Let's go. All right, I've been stuck on that. I was stuck on that this morning. I ran out of time though. I had to go out, so I couldn't do it. All right, nice. So we're gonna go through some more levels, and I get some more levels on my level rush. I was rank 8 this morning. I'm back down to 11. Oh my god. Yeah, these guys, I'm trying to... Everyone... Oh man, they've pushed up to 7-3 and 7-4. Oh my god. Okay. What's the, the ranking rewards? You've got to be rank... Well, 20, you get one of these things. But I really wanted to get more than one. But I was hoping to get top 10 to get two. But these guys are pushing... And without any RNG luck for gear upgrades, I'm not going to be able to catch them either. Yeah. Uh, feeling like a huge noodle right now when I fight people in arena way weaker than me. <laughs> uh, damn, that boss taking no damage. Oh, yeah, he's really taking it. Well, it is Apocalypse 5. I was stuck just now, and then I got 42 crit res prayer and one easily. There you go, see? Sometimes when you're stuck on this game, you get one upgrade on something. Could be research, it could, could be your prayer could be a piece of gear whatever one one little upgrade like can sometimes change the change the battle completely it's kind of crazy like that like the damage this guy does is just insane man like it's just an insane amount of damage and like this one i might i might win this one wait wait let's have a look it's possible he's doing oh he critted on me oh he crit me he crit me and i won it's weird, isn't it? Sometimes you can just go on auto and win, and then sometimes you've got to do it manually. It's kind of weird like that. I'm like 40 materials off level 4 mount, then I'll be flying around. Nice. Started playing about an hour ago, and I'm level 34, but guessing it's it gets harder to level up at a certain point. Yeah, that's what happens, Scott. So what's going to happen eventually as you're playing, right, is you're going to hit the wall. The wall is basically, you can't progress past the boss. The enemies, these enemies here, these are nothing. These are easy to kill. It's the bosses, right? So you're going to get to a boss on a level where you just can't get past it. You can't beat it. No matter what different skills you use or whatever, you, you just can't beat, you can't get past it, right? Um, and the only way you're going to be able to get past it is to upgrade your gear with lamps or do research or get higher level skills, or better pals. You know, you need to upgrade your pals. Or upgrade your upgrade your skills, right? So, yeah, like you're gonna get to a point where you just can't go any further um, until you get. What you do is you wait for the reset, and then the reset happens, and then you can get more lamps. You can go to the dungeons, and you can do your keys and access all your keys and stuff. If you're gonna buy something in this game, one thing that I would always, I, I think I would recommend, like just just for quality of life more than anything, guys, is come in here and get this thing. Skip all ads card. Oh my god, like this is pog. Like if you don't mind watching 30 second ads every time you do the extra bonuses, because what I mean is, is when you go down to the uh, dungeons, for example, you get like two or three keys um, every reset. Probably two. I get three because I got the battle pass, right? But like you get two keys on a reset, then you can get another two keys, but you gotta watch an advert, right? You gotta watch two adverts. They're paying and look how many two adverts there, two adverts there, two adverts there. It gets a bit like uh like if they're 30 seconds each, that's that's like three, four minutes of adverts you gotta endure. And that's just here. There's other bits around where you have to watch ads as well. So just having that is just it's just nice. I mean, I got it because I'm streaming the game, so I don't really want to be showing adverts every two seconds. So it's a quality of life thing. But it's ten bucks, but I mean, I I'm, I needed to get that. I can't be showing adverts every few seconds. Did you see the prizes of the family brawl? Uh, yeah, I did. I have no idea what half the stuff does, but I mean, we'll get it. The perm pass is very OP because it's one extra key. Yeah, that's what I got. Yeah, I think I got that too. 
I think I got that too. Where is it? Hang on. The, perm the permanent. Yeah, this one. No, hang on a minute. No, not that. Is that? No, not. Is it this one? This lifetime pass? Oh, yeah, this one. Yeah, yeah, this one. I'm going to get it. I might treat myself next month. It's my birthday next month. So maybe I'll treat myself next month. It's 30 quid, so it's a lot. But you do get the extra dungeon attempt, which is nice. Extra challenge tickets. Limit. Oh, okay. Increases the limit on that. Okay. Daily speed battle attempts. So you get four speed battles. Okay. So you get four speed battles, which is this thing up here. Speed battle. Makes you go faster. Okay. It's, it's, it's okay. It's good. I don't need to stress about it though. Yeah. 200 days for daily lamps, 600 gems. It's kind of nice, but I'm not going to stress about it right now. Right, this boss. Let me go and see if I can do it on manual. Let's have a look. Alright, wait. 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 Now, shield. And then heal. And then auto off. I might have done the heal a little bit too early. I think I've done the heal a little bit too early. We'll see. Mm, I think he's going to kill me. I think I lose. He's going to combo me. That wall was not going to get enough in time. Oh, no, it was so close, but he got me. Okay, let's try again. I done, I done the heal a little bit too early. Right, wait, 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 wait for it. Wait for it, wait for it. Now shield. Now wait, don't do it. Now heal. Now go. Right, that was perfect timing. We'll see. I am healing against this thing. Okay, the healing's done now. So it's going to depend if he crits me or not. I need a shield or something. Come on, guys. There we go. Shields up. Oh, my God. This guy's going to kill me again. Yeah. Man, didn't get good RNG that time. He, he was. I didn't really get enough crit damage on him. Come on. Right, wait, 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 wait. Nah, shield. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Now heal and then auto. Okay. This is actually going a bit better. I can get the shield up. That would be nice. Okay, shields up. Good, good. Okay, I need another water cannon. Come on, come on, come on. Evasion. Oh, yes. Go two evasions back to back. Oh, you're dead. Let's go. That's nice. Yo, that always helps. Evasion's awesome. They don't hit you. <laughs> All right, cool. Done it. Nice, nice. What class am I? I am a Storm Priest. My next devolution is going to be nuts, man. Look at this next devolution. My next devolution is Storm Priest to Bishop. I'm going to turn into an anime cat. I'm going to turn into this red and black anime character after. And then I'm going to go up here to Dark Lord. I'm going to be a Dark Lord. Yes, indeedy. I like this one because um, it's got some pretty good. It's got some pretty good abilities on it. Um, attack plus twelve percent, skill crit plus fifteen percent. That's crit damage. Active skills deal eighty percent extra damage to targets below fifty percent HP. So once they go below fifty percent HP, I normally do a lot more. I do a lot more damage. So that's kind of good. And like my gear, I'm trying to focus on crit skill crit and crit rate. That's what I really want to like focus on. I want to just have really high crit. Crit rate and crit and, and skill crit. So crit rate is something I'm pushing on this. Crit rate, sk skill crit. You see? Crit rate. Crit rate. Crit rate, skill crit. So I'm trying to get crit rate and skill crit. Oh, if I show you my stats, you can see here that my... Crit rate is 35.9%. It's good. It's very good. Okay, I lost again. The boss kill. These bosses are ripping me up, man. Let's try again. Boom, 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 boom. There right, we go. We're going to use the shield in just a second. Right, shield. Oh, evasion as well there. That was nice. All right, put the shit up. Go, go, go. Oh, oh. Do a, evasion's really good too, though, to be honest. Right, this is going pretty well. Shield, shield, shield. All right, good, good. Shield's up. Water's going to be ready in a few seconds. 
Okay, we need... Don't, don't, no, no, don't hit me anymore. Don't hit me anymore. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Boom. Nice. All right. Your chro Chromomancer and my shield resets way faster. Yeah, it's because you've probably got more regeneration. Uh, regeneration basically reduces your cooldown of your abilities. So if you've got a high regeneration, which you probably have with a Chromo Master. What's Chromo Master anyway? Which one's that? Chromo Master. Oh, okay, you are on the healer. You went the healer side. Okay. So yeah, healer's probably... Is it, this one's probably got more regen. So yeah, there it is. There, look. Prolong active skill, excluding Blitz Assault by 50%. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so basically the healer has faster cooldowns on their skills. Active skill energy regen plus 30%. Boom, there it is. That's that's what does it. It's not this one. That prolongs your active skills. That make when you use a skill, that makes you get 50% extra. So your your skill does your skills last for longer and they recharge quicker. That's actually pretty good. That's actually pretty good. So that's why you're, you're going to be casting more spells. But the difference between your healer mage and my my mage is I may take longer to cast my spells and they may not last as long as yours, but my spells are going to do more damage because I've got a higher crit rate and the crit chance because that's what the, the Dark Lord one is. It's about damage. So I should have higher damage than a healer mage. I just won't be able to cast as often as a healer mage. That's all. Be an interesting fight, seeing a big maxed healer mage versus a maxed dark lord mage and seeing who wins. But yeah, it's, it's interesting. Like It's interesting how all the different classes have different abilities and stuff. It's kind of cool. Um, okay, let me grab that and let's see if we can beat this boss. Here we go. All right, one, two, three, four. Get ready with the shield. Wait for it, wait for it. Let him hit me once. Right now, put the shield up. Get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. Now nah, nah, heal. Go. Oh, I won. All right, that was good. It got evasion, nice. Oh, you got tons of evasion there. But that's okay, good damage. All right, just don't crit me, just don't crit me. Evasion, nice. Counter-Strike, nice. Oh, he's dead. Unless he does something crazy, I mean, he's dead. Got him, let's go, boys. You pick Berserker, nice. I'm a sharpshooter right now. When I get to level 100, I'll evolve to Shadow Hunter. Nice. You can actually respec it. If you choose a class you don't like, you can actually respec for, I think it costs like 3,000 gems. Uh, but you can come down to here and you can click on uh, reset. Like, it costs 3,000 gems to do it. You don't have to re-level your entire character. You just basically have to come over here and click these and just basically click a, click promotion, promotion, promotion. Um, you don't get the rewards again. Uh, but you can respec for, for, for uh, but yeah, it's 3,000 to respec if you don't like the class. You can change it all up. So you can do that as well. What's up, Spar? How you doing? Yeah, I've got some pretty good damage skills. Um, like, I've got I've got more than just uh, one red. I've got like four red open. I just got this one as well. This heroic descent. That's pretty good. But because they, because I need to level up, and these bosses are so tanky, I need the shield and I need the <laughs> I need the healing regen, man. And also, these are hot. the thing is like just because you've got a red skill doesn't necessarily mean you should use it. Because look. For example, right? I've got two oranges that I'm using over the reds for damage, right? If we look at this, it's level 12. It's, it says it does three, like, durian nuts, three, three explosions when it, add, when, it, when it goes off, and it's 1,133 AoE damage each, and it's going to slow the target by 40% for five seconds. That's kind of good. And because it's level 12, I've got effect of base hp attack and defense of 192 percent now the red skill you can see here it's got an okay ability right this is actually pretty good it summons a hero spirit with free attack speed it's really fast it goes dum 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 right it's 148 percent damage each basic attack and they can't get targeted but look at the effect base hp attack and defense is only 32 percent so I'm probably going to be better off using this one for the moment because it's a higher level. So I use this one, not because it does massive damage or anything. The effect is still only 32%, but I use this one because of the disarm ability that this one's got. 
Not only does it deal 2,682% AOE damage, which is really nice, it disarms targets for three seconds, which is basically a stun. And when you're fighting bosses, man, having that three second stun is like having a shield. It's really, really helpful. So that, that one there is to stun. The shield is to protect me, the mushroom shield. The heal is to regenerate my health. All those first three skills are defensive right now because I'm not leveled up enough to just steamroll through. If I got a couple of decent gear upgrades, I'd be able to just switch these out for all attack skills and just blast through these bosses. But for now, I need to have the defensive skills on. So it's important to... It's, I like the fact that... What I like about this game is just because you've got red skills, which are higher rarity, doesn't mean that those may be the right combination to use. You might need to change up the combination depending on what you're doing. You know, and that, that's, that, that to me is an element of using your brain. So any kind of game that, allow, that tells me I've got to use my brain to work out the right combo gets a thumbs up from me. So I kind of like that. Same goes for pets. I got three red ones. Doesn't necessarily mean that all the red ones are the ones you should be using, but the red ones are pretty good, mind you. You need to look at the damage multiplier they do. You need to look at the attack speed they have. The effect is also very important. Base attack, defense, HP, 32%. Obviously, ones that I've got down here that are higher level, like this one, are going to have 336, which is kind of gnarly. Maybe we could try it out. This one here, for example, has got really high damage multiplier, but the effect is way less on the base HP defense. Maybe that would make a difference if I switch it out. Let's go for the cactus. I think the cactus could be good, but using both the cactuses as well, because I've also got a thing up here. Uh, which is an, uh, a relic increased cactus power combo rate by 25 and then effect base attack defense hp another big boost here of 176 percent so this this actually benefits cactus pals so i've got two cactus pals now that will benefit from that and i'm using this one to go with the snow and the hydro sprite increasing their damage okay and so if you look down here you can see i've got a hydro sprite and you can tell if it's a hydro sprite because it actually has it in a bubble next to it it will tell you hydro sprite so that's going to work with the relic okay and then same goes with the snail this one's a snail and it looks like a snail and you can see it says snail in blue that means it's also going to work with the relic so the two relics i've got are going to be boosting the snail both the cactuses and the hydro sprite so hopefully we do some more damage now let's go take a look and see how we go against this boss Oh, look, so let's go and challenge him. We should have some more HP based on what we did. So let's go ahead and do that. We're going to take the first hit and we're going to put our shield up. We're going to wait, wait, wait. Hit another asteroid, heal, and then auto. Let's go. We should be a little bit more tankier because that cactus had way much higher HP percentage. So we should have a lot more HP against him right now. And as you can see, we are doing all right. We're not doing too bad. I could do with a freeze. He's going to hit me again. Oh, and we, we won. There you go. So, and I wouldn't have won this if I wasn't choosing the right kind of power selection or... or what, hang on, do I need any of these? Mm, two. Nah, I don't need that. Not yet. Um, is this the new Lords Mobile collaboration? Says Romeo in the chat. No, no, this is a different game, bro. This is this is called Mush Legend Legend of Mushroom. If I've learned anything from playing another similar game, is that power pet damage scales terribly compared to skills. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard that too. Somebody said that in in the uh, world chat the other day. They were saying, "Yo, the the pals aren't great. They're they're okay, but skills are way more important." So yeah, skills are very important. Agreed. I agree with you. Mike, I thought you were saving gems for your mount. Yeah, I'm not using gems. I'm opting for lower pets with crit chance as well. Yeah, crit, that's a good idea too. Yeah, and no, I already talked about the collaboration event from Lords Mobile. There's not much really to show you. The leader skin's awful. The castle skin's actually pretty good. It's kind of cool looking. Um, but ultimately, it's another RNG pay to play event with lots of cool things that you're not going to be able to get because they're behind money walls the usual you know lately anyway igg lords mobile collaboration just a massive l to be honest with you um and it's part one of two there's going to be another part of this as well there's another collaboration event coming i don't know how long a couple of weeks probably with more stuff that's going to also be tucked behind paywalls so it is what it is 
It's just stupid, man. They, they, they used to do collaborations and people used to be able to get the stuff unlocked and actually enjoy the gimmick of it. But now you can't. It's all, it's all behind paywalls now. It's just stupid. Anyway, let's go. Next boss. Boom. 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 Wait. 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 We'll take, we'll take one hit. Now, shield goes up. Asteroid again. And... Heal. Perfect timing on the heal. We should be good. Unless he, unless he crits me really hard, but it should be good. Doing some rather nice looking damage. Nice evasion. Shields up. Looking good. We're going to get a water cannon in just a second. And he's done. He's done, Zoe. You're finished. You're finished. Get out of here. Bye. Boom. <laughs> the golden hammers you might have seen from various modes are for artifact refining. Yeah. I've been picking those up. I got a few of those. And I think the artifact is coming tonight. I think it's going to be this. Clear day six, normal 510. That's tonight's reset. So in about four hours, I should be able to unlock this. So that's kind of cool. We get an artifact tonight. Looking forward to it. I also got this tonight as well, which is the um, the family brawl. This is, um, it says sign up countdown, three hours 54. You're one day behind. Oh, okay. I don't know what this is. I don't know what half of this stuff does in here. There's loads of these different things in here. Like, I don't know what these shards are for. Used to upgrade the word worldly snare skill. I don't know. They're shards for a skill. I don't know. Honestly, I have no idea. There's some cosmetics in here, like a hamburger you can put on your head. So these are cosmetics. And there's some skills in here as well. There's immortal skills at the top. Yeah, they're shards though, aren't they? You need to get the shards. They're sh they're oh no, that's an actual skill. Oh, that's actually Pog. But it's 12,000. I bet it takes a minute to get 12,000. <laughs> like, because these tickets, uh, what, 100 tickets? Wow, 100 tickets for 500. That's kind of good. I bet it's going to take you a minute to get 12,000 though. Are we on a bump of boss yet? Oh, I beat the boss without even doing it manually. That's handy. Let's go. Do that. Ooh, right there. I'm going to try and see if I can get past this World 4. Yeah, tickets are kind of good. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, oh, I've got another draw up here. Let's see. Ah, nothing good. Let's do 80 gems. I can do 80 gems. Ah, nothing. All right, I'm saving my gems. I won't use them, I promise, guys. i got to save them. <laughs> I'll tell you what I could do. Wait, wait, wait. How many have I got? 2,600. How many do I need to upgrade my next star? No, I need to wait for Mount Rush. Don't do it now. Don't do it now. No, 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 no. Don't do it now. <laughs> i got 300. I got 300 lamps. We can do that in a sec. Yes, I've been doing my pumpkin challenge. Yo, guys, this event is kind of pog. This event's kind of pog. So this is an event that is completely free to play. 100% free to play event. Every day you can unlock 300 lamps, like 450 diamonds and a bunch of speed ups every day. Completely free to play. All you got to do is complete each puzzle in under 10 moves to get all three rewards every day. And it's basically a match free thing. So you go in and you basically got, and it's the same. It doesn't change. It's the same puzzle, right? You have to come in and you have to do it in under 10 moves to be able to get it. I, I should record this and put like a little thing out so you can see how to do it. But I think I did it like this this morning. I moved this one across one. And then I moved this one across one, I think. Mm -mm, I don't know. And then maybe this one across one. Mm, this one there. Mm, I got six more moves left. Uh, that one up. No, that's not good. You need to try and get combos. That's the thing. I only got two moves left. I'm not going to be able to do it. <laughs> I wasn't far away. Yeah. 
so I done it in like I done it in like 13. So I was three over there. But I did it this morning anyway, so I ain't got to do it again. I'm just showing you how it works. <laughs> oh, I lost against 4-9. Let's go, let's go manual. Here we go. Oh, I messed up. I will right, leave it on auto. I messed up. I'll do it again in a sec. World of Water. I know. I've had practice doing those match threes on World of Water, so I knew how to do them because World of Water's got loads of that. Did I beat that? Oh no, I'm still fighting it. I ain't gonna beat this. I need to do it manually. He's too strong. He's way too strong. Yeah, and just to show you quickly, right? That it doesn't matter whether you have red skills on or not. Yeah, look at this. Like, I'll show you. If I take these two skills off, these two orange skills, right? And like put the red ones on. Oh, surely these will be better because they're doing more damage, right? Hmm. You, you, you might think that, but watch this. Let's go with the yellows and go with the three reds and I'll show you the difference in damage. I'll do it in auto first. Let's see. Let's just see. I mean, let's just see. Using two red skills instead of the orange skills. Let's see if he takes more damage or not. I mean, the, the, the damage output is not bad. Let's let's try again manually. I don't think he took that much. Let's try again manually, though. Right, wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now, shield. Wait for the asteroid. Asteroid's up. Heal, and then auto. Oh, I was a bit late on the heal. Yeah, look at the damage. The damage is nowhere near the same. He's only halfway. And obviously we're in trouble because he's now going ham on us right now. And he's going to kill me. It was really close, to be fair. Like, there's not much difference, but because they're red skills, they're pretty good. But they're just not as good as those leveled up orange ones. And let's try again with the orange skills. The level 12 and 13 orange skills. Here we go. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to go ahead and go, 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 go. Right, now wait, wait, wait. Wait for him to attack me. Now, shield up. Okay, wait for the asteroid. Fire the asteroid, then hit the hill, and then auto. All right, let's see the difference and see if we get him this time. Oh, we just done a big crit on me. Okay, that's bad. Okay, that's bad. That's bad because we got heavily critted just then. So hopefully we can still do this. I don't know though. It's going to be sketch. That massive crit he done on me dropped my life by a significant amount. But are we going to edge it? No, we're not. Okay, that's, he critted me. Unfortunate. I got, I got a hit pretty hard. Let's do it again. All right, let's wait. Let's, try, let's at least take one hit first this time. There we go. Now shield up. Auto. Oh no. I, I messed up. <laughs> I pressed auto instead of the asteroid. My bad. I'm not perfect. I made mistakes. Yeah, the bat's cool. I used the bat as well when I had the bat. Oh, look at that massive crit he just got on me. You know when it's a crit because the big red numbers come up. Okay, yeah, yeah, that was that was an L. Okay, we took an L on that one. Here we go, let's try again. Okay, and go. Nice. All right, now wait. Take one hit, then shield. All right, now shield. Wait for the asteroid. Asteroid, heal, and auto off. There we go. Oh, lots of evasion. Just don't red number me. We should be all right. If I can just get him not to red number me. Okay, shield, 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 shield. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he's really difficult, isn't he? He's a tough one. Okay, let's try again. He's really difficult, this one. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I've done it again. I pressed auto. Okay, let's use the lamps and see if we can get a drop. Yeah, he's a tough one, this one. He's really tough. Let's, let's use our lamps and see if we can get a pink upgrade. Fingers crossed, peeps. Fingers crossed. Because mm. this boss is tough. Tough, 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 tough boss. 
Let's try again. All right. What were your thoughts on my shroom image yesterday? Very funny, bro. Bribe was in the chat putting my putting my putting my face as his profile image. It's hilarious. We didn't get no upgrade and we died. Oh my god, this one's tough. This one's tough. I think I'm going to get it. Now the water thing's almost there, but I'm going to die before it goes. Oh, I did it. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Final level of world four on apocalypse five. This, this boss is going to suck. <laughs> okay. Okay. Nice. It took a few goes that one. It took a few goes, didn't it? That one was tough. That one was very tough. I'm just doing it. Sometimes I just do them singly when I'm just waiting. I ain't got many, when, I, when, I ain't, when I ain't got many lamps, I like to just press it press it once. Just make sure when you're doing it, you don't equip it by accident. <laughs> if you got the like, you know, that would be a night that would be disaster if you did that. Oh my god. Like when I got loads of lamps, I, I just put it on auto. But when I got a few, I'll just click it. Oh, boss is here. This guy is going to be a tough one to beat. All right, let's go and see if we can beat this boss. Let me open the rest of these lamps quickly. I didn't hit the bloody asteroid in time. Oh my god. Seriously? Oh my god. This is really close. 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 Oh, come on! He was dead. How the hell do you kill me? There's no way, bro. He was dead. Come on now. What is that? One HP? What are we doing here? Oh man, he's doing loads of damage to me. This is scared. This is horrible. Oh my god, you got 3,600 lamps waiting for my lamps upgrade for me before you open them. Yeah, nice, bro. Ah, uh, you're in the top eight now. That's very good. Nice, Ryan. I like, love to hear that. Okay. Oh, uh, the asteroid. I clicked it and it didn't go. Oh, that evasion was beautiful. That evasion was actually beautiful. Okay, just don't... Oh, another evasion as well. Just don't crit me. Just don't crit me. Don't crit me and I've got this. Don't crit me and I've got this. Come on. Oh, another evasion. Oh, he crit me. Yo. Are we still going to do it though? Another evasion. I got him. He's dead. Yes, go. You know what? I thought I got it. Like, But he hit me with a massive crit, but it was enough. Yo, level five. Sweet. Apocalypse 5 World 5. This is going to be this is going to be insane. Let me take let me let me let me take off one of my um hang on a minute. 
Now, the, the way I can do more damage is if I go to my skills and I take off, like, this mushroom. Take off the mushroom and, like... Let's put this on. Let's see. Probably not going to work. But this is what I normally do. I normally run just the heal and then I put another attack skill on. Almost level 50. Nice, bro. Now, just so you know, last night I opened up four and a half thousand lamps last night and I got one upgrade on my pink gear. Four and a half thousand lamps. <laughs> and I literally got one pink upgrade, which was this hat. 90, level 93. Yeah, one upgrade, peeps. On four and a half thousand. I did get a couple of other pink drops, but they weren't no good. Oh man, she does so much damage. Oh my god. Yeah, life's nowhere near done. Okay, I need that. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Okay, so I'm gonna need to put the heal back on. The shield. I don't know if we're gonna get this one. She's pretty tough. I'll wait till she gets close. Alright, now shield. Oh, wow. Well, that was pretty good. We'll see. I mean, I've done as much damage as I possibly could there, to be honest with you. She's got a shield up. Nice. We're going we're gonna to get... We might, we might do this one. We've got water coming in a few seconds. Here we go. She's going to get stunned. There's the stun. And I kill her, kill her, kill her. Come on. No way. She had a tiny bit of life. Like, no way, bro. How are you not dying? How are you getting me before? Like, what the... F okay. <laughs> uh, okay. 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 Shield up. Heal. Go. Alright. Stun, stun. Man, she's just doing so much damage. It's not even funny. Oh my god, look at her damage. Oh, she's got to die now. Surely. 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 Yo, she's dead. She's got no HP. There it is. Oh my god. Like, come on, game. Are you ready to fight when open server fight happens? I mean, I, I hope so. What, on this game? I ho yeah, we should be by the time C SVS comes around. I ho hopefully. Should be strong enough. We'll see. Prince, should I get the 1k clock winder? I have 40,000 gems. No, no, no. Lumine, save your gems. Save your gems for the mount rush. Just wait. Just wait, for, just wait for the Mount Rush event to come up. Yeah, and then you're going to come in here probably. Don't use all your gems on it, but like come in here, go down, and they are clock winders. You'll get the clock winders. You, you can get a thousand of them, but don't do it right now. Wait for the event. Just wait for the event. Don't use those now. You need to wait for the event, all right? I really probably shouldn't have leveled up this to this. I should have just waited for the, for the event to come around. But the thing is, I want to keep leveling up and I can't get put I couldn't get past the levels I was on and I, I leveled it up because there's also another event which is level rush and so I'm up to I'm up to 10th place now which is cool I've pushed up to 10th like I'm trying to compete for a top 10 spot in level rush and I couldn't have done that if I didn't get my mount upgraded so I leveled up my mount just enough to enable me to try and get a top 10 spot in this event and I'm going to save the rest of my whatever I do when, when, the, when the other event comes around. Mount Rush, what's that? It's going to be the same as this. Look, Level Rush, Prayer Rush. Prayer Rush is who's using all the like, farming, who's doing the most farming, using the like, growing fruits and stuff, yeah? Level Rush is 
obviously you know, level rush speaks for itself and there's going to be a mount rush okay there's going to be a mount rush in here trust me hold your diamonds rivals red damage easily what's that that durian skill is really op for sure yeah it's really good this durian one yeah it's good although i'm dying because i'm a little bit under leveled here this is quite difficult okay here we go uh boom 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 all right shield up a heal and auto that was good timing the timing the t it's all about timing and luck i got an evasion that was nice just don't crit me. Just don't crit me. Come on, get another evasion. Where's my evasion at? Come on, evasion. All right, she's going to go. I need I need the water. I need the water now. Water now. Come on. Where's the water at? There it is. Big stun. Big stun. Big stun. Hit her. Hit her. Hit her. She's dead. Well, she's dead. There it is. Okay, cool. We're getting past these witches. Just. Oh, my God. It's so tight. But I'm getting through them. Uh, let me go ahead and see if I've got any more mining pickaxes. Um, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, man. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, I'll just put this there, whatever. Seven, eight. Oh, there do. Slowly building that back up. How's the farms doing? Five hours, two hours, 20 minutes. Might as well grab those. Might as well grab those peeps. Let's get them. Nice. And we can plant some more seeds. What are we going to get? And we get... Um, cabbages. <laughs> Damn. Uh, we're going to go steal this guy's plant dude's in there. He's stealing it too. <laughs> uh, who else are we going to go steal? Uh, psycho. Cabbages. Uh, don't really want cabbages. Anything else? Alright, so what I do when I'm looking for somebody else's farm to go and rob. I normally go up to the rankings. Um... Ooh. Thanks. Uh, let's go to the rankings and then pop up to the family rankings. We're second at the moment in the king, like in, in for rankings. So I'll go to Uwu. I'll go and check out Uwu and see if they've got anything. We'll go and check out Uwu. Let's see if we can rob these guys. This one's already getting robbed. Look, Lamine. Lamine! Yo, Lamine, I see you in the chat. You're robbing this dude's plants. <laughs> Zem, has Zem got any? Nah. Right, let's go down the list a little bit. This guy. Oh, there you go. Boom. Nice, we'll rob his. All right, we also got some tokens then. Let me go see if I can get some more lamps. Nice. 80 lamps. Sweet. See, suddenly I got 200 lamps now. We'll see if we can get lucky. Wait, did I kill another boss on auto? I think I might have done. I might have killed another boss on auto. No, no, I don't want to rob you. It's all right. So happy Mike can't rob my farm because I have nobody added to beat him. <laughs> Third place family are boosting like crazy. Almost caught us up. Yeah, they've been on our towels the whole time, but we'll be all right. Just need everybody active doing what they got to do to level up. That's all. Like, I've been looking to, for activity to make sure everyone's doing what they need to be doing. So, like, this is a new week. It's Monday today. So, everybody right now, we're considering reset is only four hours away. Everybody should be on 500 weekly activity. Everybody. So this person here, Ahmed, he's on zero. This is this is this is not good. He needs to go and do a donation thing. So I'm gonna message him. Um, send a message uh, to Ahmed. Please do 
your donations at, at the family building. Like, everybody does it. It costs a few diamonds every day, but everybody does it. And if I have somebody in my guild that's not not contributing the diamonds, they will be removed from my guild. So Ahmed needs to go and do that. Everybody else, though, look, everyone's on 500. Everybody's done it today. Like, everybody here contributes. Aloha is the same Aloha from Lord's Mobile, by the way, guys. The level, the, the, the level 16 castle with the gold champ gear. <laughs> Aloha joined my guild. He's, he's, he needs to do one more donation. He hasn't finished it. But other than that, there's one, there's a couple people here. This Colonator, 16 hours ago, 22 hours ago. These people might get kicked because they're just not, especially this one, 22 hours. It's a shame because he's got all pink gear. He's really good, but he needs to be online and he needs to go and get, he's, he needs to go and get the donations done before the next pack reset. If that goes over 24 hours, he'll be removed. Like I'm not having anybody in the guild over 24 hours offline. The same as World of Water. If you're over, if you're offline over 24 hours, you'll be removed. Got to keep the guild active. Everyone's online for the most part. Everyone's doing their bit. It's not fair that one or two people are not. So they'll get removed instantly. I won't even, I won't even talk to them. I won't even message them. If they go over 24 hours, removed. Bye. There's plenty of, there's a whole list of people that want to join. So I'll bring someone in that wants to contribute. Yeah, that's just too much. Too, that, that person who's been offline 16 or 22 hours hasn't done any of the uh, any of the raid bosses today. He hasn't done his chest event. He has probably hasn't even, you know what I mean? Like he's missed everything for the last 22 hours. So he'll probably get removed. But Terra's my R4 and Terra's brutal. He will remove people so quickly when they don't do what they got to do. Mike, the amount of times I see you offline in WoW more than 24 hours. Yeah, but Ryan, you have to understand one thing. I'm the leader, so I can do what I want. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, but I always log on and get my dailies done for the most part. Like, even though it's sometimes just 24 hours, I've been online within that time doing my dailies. I always get my dailies done. Uh, Swazi says, good evening, Prince. I want to ask where I can sell my Lord's Mobile account where I won't get scammed. Um, I can't answer that question because I do not condone buying and selling Lord's Mobile accounts. Sorry, dude. And again, even if I knew somewhere where you could do it, I wouldn't tell you. Do you want to know why? Because if I told you where you could go to sell your Lord's mobile account and then you went and had a bad experience, I would get I would be then to blame for telling you where to go. So sorry, dude. I can't give you any advice on where to buy or sell a Lord's mobile account. Sorry, bro. Um, okay. Let's go and get this boss. 5-4. Let's get it. The switch is going down. And I said which. Uh, I actually was late here, my asteroid there. That was that was kind of annoying. Um, okay, we're gonna heal, heal, and then go. I don't think I'll do this one. I was late on my asteroid. Yeah, sorry, bro. Okay. Actually, it's looking pretty good. We ain't much. We ain't lost. We ain't lost much health here. This is actually looking pretty. Oh, I don't know actually. Um, actually, no. It's still looking. We're still looking good. We got half our HP left. There's no way she beats us. And she's just been stunned. Oh, you're done. You're so done. You're not beating me here. There's no way. Yeah, we annihilated her. Let's go. Nice. Nice, nice. Let's use the lamps. See what we get. Come on. We've been waiting for an upgrade. I've done like over a thousand lamps. Give me a, <laughs> give me a pink. Give me a good pink that I need. Come on. Come on, game. Come on, game. Come on, game. Come on. Give me that drop. I desperately need a gear upgrade here. Because I'm getting... It's getting more and more difficult. Ah, uh, come on. It's so annoying. <laughs> I want my dopamine hit. <laughs> Give me my dopamine. Oh, my God. Nothing again. Jeez. Louise. You got four pinks from like 10k lamps. The so drop rates check out. Yeah, yeah, the drop rates are legit. But I done four and a half thousand lamps last night and got like three pinks, but two of them I couldn't use because they weren't what I wanted skill wise. Uh, they they had slightly higher stats, but not that much more to be honest. Like I need to get a pink on the one that's level 77. Like I need I need like a level 91 or 92 drop on the upgrades from the level 77 or the. 79 or the 83s that like those would be big but, but i don't want to get a pink on the main hand because 87 93 on the hat 
90 on the on the on the on the wrist guard. So I need to get something which is an upgrade on the lower one. Okay. Can I check world rank 777777 in KVK? No. What prayers do you have right now? Uh, prayers, I am here. I have A, 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 and C. Obviously, I'm working on the C one down here for skill damage. Um, trying to get up to level four so I can possibly get some S ranks would be nice. That's where we're at. I need like I need a lot more stones to do a research. And I haven't got any tickets. So yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm at that wall a little bit. Bro has A's. Yeah. Is it not worth trying out crit resistance? You might, like, no, not right now it's not. Because look. I'm my statue's level three. And these are my these are my these are my um drop rates. At level three, I have a zero percent chance to get S at level three. So if I roll that A again, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just hurting myself. Once I get to level four, I get a five percent chance to get an S. Then I'll try and gamble, to see if I can get some S ranks. I ain't gonna do it yet, because I've got these all on A. There's no point risking it just yet. Please check world ranking in KBK. No. How much have I spent? Um, uh, don't know. <laughs> Not that much. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't like talking about that on 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 mobile games. <laughs> Nowhere near what I've spent on Lords. Let's just say that much. You can check it in the spending event. Yeah, you know. I know you can. That doesn't mean I'm gonna. <laughs> Scar. That doesn't mean I'm gonna. Hey, I think I, I just I don't I don't like that question, man. Like I bought a couple of packs. That's it, man. You know, what I mean, I bought some packs, upgraded some stuff. You know, that's that's it. You know. Yeah, why ask that? I don't I don't understand why that's important. I I, I hate that question. I mean, it's just I don't know. Hmm. I bought a couple of packs, leveled up a little bit. Nothing too crazy though. I've been buying pretty much like all the one dollar packs and five dollar packs. The most expensive thing I bought, I think, was a ten dollar pack, which was just to remove all the adverts. How did you check the guild players? I don't know how to. You go up to your avatar, then you go down to rank, and then you click on family, and then you can look at all the guilds, click on them, and go look and see if they've got any plants. You click on the player Shroomy Farm, and you go take a look and see if they've got any plants. Go to another player, click it, Shroomy Farm. You can go and look at all their farms. You can go and see if there's got if they've got anything you can you can pinch off them. I can even help them. I can even help speed it up to try and steal it if it's only got a few minutes left on it as well. It's kind of funny. See if we can find one that's good. There you go. Legendary as well. Let's go. Nice. Just gotta look around. Look around some players. You'll find some eventually and just kind of steal their stuff. What are we doing on this level rush? Not as much as Morbid, no. Yeah, the Morbid's went a lot. All right, so we're at rank 10. Okay. He's so far ahead of me, 7404. Damn, man. Prince, can I join your family on level 55? I think it's level 70 upwards we're looking for now, dude. But actually, 55, you could join, I suppose. I ain't got an issue with it. Let me let me, let me see if we're going to make any spaces later, because I think we might be making some space later, to be honest with you. Oh, that hill was clutch. Yo, that hill that just came into the end there. Clutched it. I've done it on auto. Nice. Nice. All right, sweet. 
Let's go. Let's see if we can get an upgrade. Come on, upgrades. Where are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That's good. I think that's good. That's a big attack boost and defense boost and HP boost and crit rate increases. No, the crit rate is a decrease, unfortunately. It's 4.3 currently. It goes down to 3.7. I lose counter strike and I gain combo damage. I think it's better, but you'll have to wait and see when I put it on. Oh, yeah, 14,000. All right, cool. Nice. Well, we got a little upgrade there. That was good. I got a pink. I got a pink. That's good. That, that is good. I mean, it wasn't a huge upgrade, but it definitely was. It's all right. I'll take it. Prince, I'm free to play. Is my account good? Yeah, I mean, we've got, we got a lot of, got, got of free-to-play players in the guild. Not everyone's buying packs. I'm not going to not bring in people that... I'm not going to let people... I'm not, I'm not just going to have pay-to-play players in the guild. We've got some free-to-play players in here too. Because the game's very free-to-play friendly. There's no reason to have all... We've got, we've got a few pay-to-play players. We've got a few free-to-play players. We've got a bit of both. The game refuses to give you pink or reds. But don't forget, I'm level 17 lamp now. So my drop rate is... 0.05 percent <laughs> like it's still really low that was a that was a, that was a good drop i got there would have got top 100 in arena last night but bad rng means i never you will get there don't worry it's funny to hear the word pink it is a slang word for p in swedish <laughs> is it really that's hilarious yeah, no, it is very free to play friendly, 100%. Like, obviously, it's a mobile game, so there's going to be monetization. It's going to give you an advantage, make you stronger, etc. Of course, but the game's very free to play friendly. You don't need to spend on it. Yo, I'm actually beating these witches on auto because of the upgrade. I think this is actually kind of good, guys. It's kind of good. I like what I'm seeing. But now, anyway. Is this a strategy game? Is there, is there guilds? Is there attacks or guild wars? So it's not like Lords Mobile, okay? It's not troops and building upgrades and all that, all that, all right? It's uh, an, it's called an idle RPG. That's the that's the game title. It's an idle RPG. So your character moves across the screen automatically, fighting the enemies, and in every stage you have a boss, right? And as you complete, there's 10 different worlds. And as you complete it, you go back to the beginning and it, you, then you start on a higher difficulty setting. So you start off on easy and then it goes normal, then it goes hard, then it goes hell, then it goes to abyss, uh, abyss. After abyss, you get to apocalypse. And there's different, there's different levels of hell and abyss. There's like hell one, hell two, hell three, abyss one, abyss two, abyss three, abyss four. So you have to go through the game like it goes, it continue, it goes, goes and goes and goes and goes and goes and gets harder and harder and harder. So how do you get through the harder levels? Well, you have to upgrade your gear by getting lamps to rub the lamp. You have to use gold to upgrade the lamp. Okay, so you can get higher drop rates to drop higher level gear. That's how you get the better gear. That's why it's very important in the early stages to focus on your lamp as a priority so you can push it up so you can get higher rarity gear. Okay, right now I'm working on pink gear down here. But yeah, it's difficult to get. Um, so gear is really important. It helps you out a bunch. And then of course you have these little creatures that are running around me. You have pets and you have skills that you unlock and you use to fight with. All right. And you get those by doing gacha, the gacha pond machine. So you have a gacha pond machine here for skills. You have a gacha pond machine here for the pals. All right. Now you have to use your tickets. You can't just save all your tickets up for later because as you use your tickets, you gain XP on your gachapon machine and you level it up. And just like the lamp, the same thing happens here. The higher your level is, the more probability you have of unlocking the higher level um, items. So you can see the maximum level on this is 15%. That's max, right? Which means you'll all oh, the, the, the pink skill 0.04 is really low, but it's, you need to level it up to have a chance of getting that. Now you see this. Uh, mine's currently level 11, yeah, and you can see it's 0.1% chance of legendary. All the legendary skills I've got, which are all these here, look. 
You see all these red ones I've got? Hold on. These red ones, I've got four. There's only two I haven't got. I got these four legendary skills, right? I got them all from the Gachapon machine on a 0.1% drop rate. So that's pretty good. The same goes for the pals. You level these up and you increase the drop rate. My current drop rate is 0.1 again. And the red ones I've got from the power box have all been on that 0.1. I haven't got loads of them. I've got three, I think. Yeah, I've got three. Three red pals that I picked up and that's all from the Gachapon machine. And then the other things you can do to get stats is the new things I opened up here. You've got the research at the top. This is the research tree. There's only one research tree in the game. And this is the research tree. I'm currently here working on these HPs. I need like 12,000 rocks to do the next one. But there is more down here. Look. That's it. I'm not far. I'm doing all right. I'm making good progress for the research. But this really helps you out as well. The other thing you can do to gain stats and help you get through is you can do the player statue, which is this thing on your blessings. Just died. <laughs> you can do this on your blessings. So for this, you have to use food. You have to give food to the statue to try and... And again, it's RNG. Look. At level three, these are the percentage chances I've got of dropping these particular levels of skills. So I've got to get to level four to be able to possibly get an S rank, 5% drop rate. And you can lock them. So I lock them so they don't spin. I want to keep that as A for the moment. I'm just trying to reroll that bottom one. Um, and you, what you do is you grow the food on your farms. Okay. You level up these buildings as well. As you grow food, you generate these that are obtained when increasing the harvest level. Can be used to upgrade mana buildings. Yeah. So as you increase your harvest, you get little mushroom houses. And you use these to level these things up. And you can see you get global attack, global defense, harvest quality bonus off that one. The greenhouse gives you daily seed count refresh and increase on that. Harvest quality and growth speed. And the mushroom thing is attack, defense, and global growth speed bonus. So you level those up as you go along as well. All right. And that all goes with the player statue. These two things over here, parking wars and dormitory. I don't know what they to those two do yet because we haven't got them unlocked yet. Um, the other thing which you can do as well is, well, the thing that's a bit out of the moment is this. You've got the relics and you have to use these little forks to search for relics. Now, it's not 5,250 when you first start off. It's, um, it's actually way less. It gets more expensive. The more relics you find, the more expensive it gets as far as how much it, are these forks you need. And you also level up these relics as well with the forks. You can enhance them. How do you get the forks? Well, you go down to the dungeons and you have this ruined ancient city and at reset, you're going to be able to play this event in here where you team up with other guildmates or other random people and fight against enemies. And at the end, you get a bonus and you get a bunch of those forks. And then you use those to go and search for relics and upgrade. You can also get forks in events. There's events in the game that you play that give you forks. Same goes for this one here. Assault lamp is a magic carpet man. You fight him, you get a bunch of lamps. Same here, you get Molten Ruins, you get diamonds and tickets for the Gachapon machine. And the new one that we just unlocked was Chrono Tower. You do this one to get the little winding keys, which you use to upgrade the mounts. Which brings me onto the mounts. We just got this yesterday. You start off with a lily pad and you have to use these little winding keys to upgrade. Okay, so you upgrade the stars and when you get to the top, you get another one. It's really cheap at first. It gets more and more expensive as you level up. Yeah. So I managed to level up to this yesterday. And then last night, I managed to save some diamonds. At pack reset, I bought myself some more winders. And I got myself up to the glider. And I got my first star. So I'm now working on this. And you get some pretty decent stat upgrades for working on this. That's mostly the, the ways you... You know, there ain't much more other than that as far as how you level up. Just got to keep an eye on the events. Oh, there is another thing as well, actually, that, I, that you can get stats from. Um, as you level up your, not this, as you level up your pals and as you level up your skills, right? As you level these all up, they're all important because what you get is this thing up, not this, the handbook, the skill handbook. Yeah. One for skills, one for pals. And you can see here, if you meet these requirements and get certain levels, for example, these level one skills, if I get them all to level 80, those three, I get extra counter damage plus 5.4%. It's a plus 0.6% increase. I get counter damage increases. So if you get certain combinations of skills leveled up, 
you can actually get some pretty nice stat increases in here and there's loads of them look like there, combo damage plus 24 percent if i can get that mushroom to 15 and that bat to 15 that combo there impenetrable armor will basically give me another real cool stat same for this green ball look if i get that green ball to level three then i can get this thing upgraded so like there's different things you can do like which is kind of nice it's kind of nice uh, so yeah, that's that's another way you can get stats by getting combinations of the of the things. Anyway, there you go. That's a bit of information for you on how it all works. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna do one more go at this. I'm gonna jump off. I think, guys, let's have a look. Uh, boom, 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 boom. Got to live. Oh, this is the final boss of World Five. Holy crap! Must have killed a couple on auto. You're 199 out of 200 clocks away from another board star. Nice. World chat super toxic. Yeah, I stay out of world chat. Oh, I don't even go in there. A couple of times I've gone in there, but it's pretty toxic. It's, it's, during the day, it's just a lot of kids just being kids, you know. Ah, oh, we died. Damn. Can I get this final boss done here? Let's take a look and see if we can do it. Shield. Asteroid life guard. You were in there at 2 a.m. this morning. Yeah, I was talking to a couple of people in there at 2 a.m. this morning, but I don't I don't really go in there very often. Do I still play World of Water? Yeah, absolutely. I was on it this morning doing my dailies and doing rallies and stuff. <laughs> Rallying Octopus this morning. Yeah, I still play it. I'm the overlord of the ocean right now. It's cool. Oh, God's sake, that was so close. She was pretty much dead. Okay. She's doing too much damage to me, man. The damage is insane. That shield there is not lasting long enough. She's pulling me down too much here. I get another stun. I don't think it's going to be enough. There's no skills hitting her. There's no skills hitting her there. Nah, no, man. I need skills hitting her when that stun goes off and there's nothing refreshed. There's, it's all... Oh, God. Come on. Oh, I hit the hill by accident. Shh. That's a rip. Maybe it won't be. Hold on. Actually, it might work out. Hold on a sec, because the shield's just in front of it. Hang on, this this might work. I'm just looking at the timings here. The shield's going to go here. And the hill's right behind it. Oh, oh, the hill's going off now. Oh, that might have actually worked, you know. Oh, hey, yo, the timing on that. Yo, the shield and the hill were working really good there. That was kind of good. The timing was really nice there, actually. That worked, worked, luckily worked out. Let's go ahead and use these 100 lamps. See if we get something drop. I doubt it, because we literally just got a pink upgrade. World 6, Apocalypse 5. Nice. No, we didn't get nothing. Have I finished robbing people yet? <laughs> Yo, robbing is you have to you have to rob people's resources, man. Oh, legendary. Yes. Oh, you know what? It's only cabbages, but I'll take it. Why not? It's better than nothing. No. Mm, oh, look, a level 91 red. That's a nice item, but it's not it's not better than my immortal one, unfortunately. You can't beat the pumpkin boss today. Keep going. It's, it's not too bad. You can do it. Prince, what? Um, 
This game, Legend of Mushroom, it'll make more easily. It'll make it more easy to quit Lords Mobile after seven years. I'm not quitting Lords Mobile, guys. I mean, I, Lords Mobile, I find extremely frustrating at the moment in a big way. I'm not quitting. Um, just just frustrated with it. To be honest with you, it's in a real, it's a real, real. It's, it, Lords Mobile is in a really weird place right now, and it seems like IGG are really struggling to get on the same level as their community. And if they keep going the way they're going, they're just going to end up pushing everyone away, to be honest with you. Which is really frustrating to see them doing this. It's such an awesome game. Really is, really is annoying. But they, you know, it's their game. They've got to do what they got to do. They, they, they're doing what they think is right, I guess. But whoever's giving them advice or telling them what to do, oh my god, man. I don't think they play, the, play their own game. Oh, we annihilated that dude. That guy got smacked. Get out of here, bro. Hey, Worthy, if you get a room in your guild, can I join? Yeah, sure, bro. Just need a room. Need space. That's the problem. Um, Let's use these 33 up. And we get nothing. Okay. All right, I'm going to keep going until a boss kills me, and then I'm going to jump off, guys. Been a good stream, though. I want to say thank you to everyone that stayed in the stream after the uh after the lord's part and for all the new people that are here thank you for being here too don't forget to smash the like button and hit the subscribe button it's been lovely seeing the subscriber count going up lately guys i really appreciate the support thank you very much um we're gonna be just just so you guys know that are here right now um when i do a live stream okay the thumbnail does not dictate... I'm going to keep saying this every stream for a week or so so you guys all hear about it. The thumbnail does not dictate the full content of the stream. So if it's a Lord's Mobile thumbnail, yes, there will be Lord's Mobile in the stream, probably at the start. I always start with what the thumbnail is, okay? So yesterday, for example, yesterday, for example, it was KBK uh, yesterday in Lord's Mobile. And yesterday's stream was the thumbnail is a legend of mushroom thumbnail for the big raid we did no 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 the, the, the thumbnail yesterday was a was a was a was a thumbnail for legend of mushroom with the big raid on it right it says um dungeon raid or no was it boss raid or whatever it was called but what people don't know is we done that for a bit and then we jumped onto world of water done my dailies and then we jumped onto i explained what it's like being overlord of the ocean and then we jumped onto lords mobile and we played Lords Mobile in KVK and we got capped on a rally trap and it was fun and we, we were having a bit of fun on Lords, weren't we? So, again, the thumbnail doesn't necessarily dictate what the entire stream is going to be. Just because I pop a live stream up and it's got Legend of Mushroom on the thumbnail or World of Water doesn't mean I'm not going to play Lords or play World of Water in it or, or this, you know. I'm going to be playing different games in the streams. So, just a heads up. If you see a stream go up and it's got a different thumbnail to Lords, Pop in and say hello. Hang out for a bit. We might get onto the games you want to see. All right. Am I done with Final Fantasy X? No, no, no. I just got to get my mojo back for it because I've taken a bit of a break off it. And I need to get back on it. This week, I'm going to get a stream going in the evening one night doing Final Fantasy X because I'm about 70% of the way through it. I need to finish it. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get it done. Don't worry. I'm not going to leave it in the shadows. We will get it done. Yo, these boss... Why is Apocalypse 6 easier than Apocalypse 5? Well, the actual... Sorry, the... You know, the stage. Apocalypse 5, stage 6 seems easier than 5. Killing these guys on auto right now. Let's go. I'm hungry, man. I'm going to have to cook some food in a minute. I'm going to have a steak. You're waiting for the World of Water gear check. <laughs> Dude, there's only three sets of gear you can get in World of Water. How dare you steal my seeds again? I was... Oh, Falcon Gamer, you're in the chat. What's up, bro? Yeah, about that, dude. <laughs> I stole this guy's seeds. Yo, I'm so sorry, bro. But you had some cabbages and I just, I, they look so delicious. I was like, I gotta get those cabbages, you know? <laughs> There's no one available to steal from here. Hmm. Hmm. 
available in three minutes oh baby baby oh we're gonna nick this we're gonna take this guy's plums watch this look, look, look. help fertilize watch this look. help fertilize <laughs> you see that i help i fertilized these plants just so i could steal them i helped him out i fertilized these plants for him <laughs> igg taking mad l's lately yeah i know it's really frustrating to see him doing it man i, I don't get it it's crazy is that your method too? Feed them and then steal them. Absolutely. Mike obviously don't want my rainbow gourd. I have growling. <laughs> Growing. I think it's a growling. Whatever you're streaming, it will be a pleasure to watch you. I remember the days when the donation equals drinking. Best streaming that I have watched ever. Yeah, the thing is, I don't drink alcohol no more. So it's a bit difficult to do that now, bro. I don't drink booze anymore. So yeah, no more alcohol for me. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. I mean, I feel bad about what happened on Saturday night. I didn't, I don't know if I told you guys. I think I did actually mention it yesterday. But I went out Saturday night to a gig and I needed a drink, right? I went to the bar and asked if they had any water. They didn't have no water. Like, how does a bar not have water? Do you know what I mean? And then he turned around and said to me, do you want some, I can give you a, I can give you a glass of tonic water. And I said, okay, I, I talked about this yesterday, actually, I remember. But yeah, I got some tonic water. I drank it and it tasted weird. And I got back home and I went to the internet and looked at what the ingredients were in Schweppes tonic water. And the first ingredient is sugar. Second ingredient is um, citric acid, the processed citric acid, not the citric acid from lemons, the fake shit. And then it was like um, natural flavorings and emulsifiers. I was like, oh no. Like, I felt like I needed to go on a detox for two days after having a tonic water. So yeah, I don't drink alcohol. No, <laughs> uh, no, 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 no. Um, so yeah, I'll be staying away from tonic water in the future. How does water have sugar and citric acid and natural flavorings and all this crap? Like Schweppes, they're part of the they're part of the Coca-Cola company. I think that explains everything you need to know right there, guys. And they're part of the Coca-Cola company. Of course, it's got sugar in it. Like they put sugar in everything because they want you to buy more of it and get you addicted. That's what sugar does. It's like cocaine, heroin. It's more it's more addictive than the cocaine or heroin. Don't get me started on this subject because I can talk for days about this shit. <laughs> Speed up your plants. I'm going to steal them. Yo, don't touch my flowers, bro. It's 28 minutes on it. I can't speed it up because I don't have no fertilizer. Leave my, leave my cabbage. Get away from my cabbages. Yo, we are annihilating this. Okay, come, let's see if we can have an upgrade. Come on, give me an upgrade. Please. Pink, 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 pink. Where are you? Come on. Come on, pink. Let's go. Come on, pink. Where are you? Game's like, no, you ain't having pink. You already had a pink. Okay. Here's the interesting thing, though, guys, about this game, this mushroom game. I've been playing it for a couple of hours. And I've been opening up lamps. I've been doing research bits. I've been doing events. I've been playing this game and having fun with it. I've actually had to do it manually to use skill to get past some of these levels because they were quite difficult. We've had fun, haven't we, chat? Playing this for the last couple of hours. And chat, how much money have I spent on this game in the last couple of hours? How much have I needed to spend in the last two hours to upgrade and do what I've been doing and get past these levels? Let me know, chat. How much have I had to spend during this stream to actually have fun and get past these Apocalypse 5 levels, which are really difficult? How much money did I have to spend today on today's stream? I think you all know the answer to that question, right? And we got a level 90 pink upgrade as well today. And how much did that cost me? How much did that, how much did that level 90 pink upgrade cost me on my gear today? Huge upgrade. Massive, massive HP upgrade. How much did we spend? Yeah. Zero. Zero. Big fat zero. Zero buckaroos. Indeed. Look, we're going to kill this boss as well. Look, this guy's getting clapped. Bye. Dead. Zero. Exactly. Get away of, get away of the Chinese chomping cabbages. <laughs> Yo! 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 Lumine! Lumine, 
What are you doing touching my cabbages, Lamine? Nah, Lamine, I'm gonna I'm gonna smack you so hard you're gonna disappear. Watch this. Ah, boom, you're dead. <laughs> yo, okay. yo, Dylan! What are you doing, bro? Get out of my garden! What is this? Get this guy out of my garden. Ah, he's gone. Get out of here, Dylan. Yo, why are you guys stealing my cabbages? Get your hands off my cabbages. You're worse than the bloody snails. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna pick my cabbages before anybody else tries to steal them. I'm not even online. What the hell? I have no idea, Dylan. Oh, wait. It's not. Oh, it's a different Dylan. Oh, okay. Please don't give me cabbages. Give me something good. Give me something good. Give me something good. Come on. Don't give me cabbages. Oh. Oh. Legendary crop. Let's go. Nice. 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 That's, that's good. That's good. Yo, this has got 25 minutes on it. I can't do anything about it. Someone's going to try and steal my eggplants. I know they are. I ain't only got cabbages, bro. I got eggplants. I got, I got legendary crops. I got all sorts of nice things growing in here now. Someone's going to try and get my bloody plums or eggplants in a couple of, in, a, in a, about 25 minutes. You know someone's going to try and steal those. All right, we're up to 6-6. Six, six. Are we going to get through this one too? We're doing pretty good against these bosses. I have to say, I'm kind of, I'm kind of happy I'm getting through Apocalypse 5, the World 6 pretty well. This boss is tanky. Oh my God. Don't check your fu- <gasps> Yo! Yo! Get away from my eggplants! You sped them up for me though, thanks. I'm still going to kill you though. Three, two, one, bye. Boom. <laughs> oh, Dylan putting up a fight. Yo, Dylan, you're putting up a fight, bro. But listen, my HP ain't going down. What's, what's going on with my HP bar, Dylan? You ain't doing no damage, Dylan. Get out of my garden. Go on, I'm waiting for somebody else to take my plants. Who's this guy? Who's this? Terra. Yo, Terra, you, you want some? All right, Terra, let's go, Terra. Yo, Terra, you might be able to beat me in World of Water, bro, but this is Mushroom Kingdom. You're getting clapped. Let's go, Terra. Let's go, Terra. What you got, Terra? Oh, yeah. I see, I, yeah there it is. Look, Terra, Terra, Terra brought it. He's got a little plane. Look, he's got a little plane. Look, you can, come on. Come on, Terra. <laughs> if this was World of Water, he would squash me like a bug. But it's not World of Water. We're, we're above land. He's only good in the water. He's got gills. You know, legends say that Terra does actually have gills, you know. Yeah, Terra got squashed. There it is. Yo, guys, get out of my garden, though. Yo, Falcon Gamer, you're going to die in two seconds. Watch this. And one, two. Get out of here. All right, you're dead. <laughs> Yo, I'm literally beating up on the chat. This is great. I love this game. I'm beating up on chat. It's so much fun. <laughs> All right, there we go. Let's plot this. Yo, Terror actually uh, was a bit of a fight. He took a few seconds to take down. <laughs> oh, another legendary. Let's go. Gold. We've got three gold crops now. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, thank you very much, Dylan, for speeding up my plants. I do appreciate it, dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, guys. We, I, I'm, I'm, I wanted to end the stream, but we're still killing bosses. We're still killing bosses. Like, hello? Are we going to die soon? Let's see if we get anything drop, get anything drop out of here. Anything? 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 No. I got a mythic, 92. <sighs> yeah, that's gonna be no good. Unfortunately, that's gonna be no good. Nice hat though. Actually, a nice, cool looking hat. Do I get that unlocked now? Yeah, I do. Oh, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. The bank, the banquet hat. <laughs> oh, I got that one too. Look, I got a little pirate hat as well. No, I kind of like that. So do I stick with the crown, or do I go? Oh, I got to stick with the crown, in it. Yeah, I got to stick with the crown. Mhm. Mm what we got in here? I got googly. Yo, the googly eyeglasses are kind of pog. I like the googly eyeglasses. 
I've got the little cat glasses as well. <laughs> I got diamond glasses. Look at that. They're little pl Playboy glasses. Oh, they're called Playboy glasses. <laughs> they're called Playboy glasses. What the heck? Yo, we got this one. That looks weird. What red ones have I got? I've got those ones. The red ones are not all that. I don't like the red ones. And the only pink ones I've got are those ones. Yo, I think we got to go with Playboy glasses, guys. Yep. Oh shit, hang on a minute. I didn't select it. I think we have to go with Playboy glasses. Uh, main hand weapons. I don't think I've got anything else other than these two. Yeah, I ain't got many of the weapons. Got a little windmill. Frog. Ooh, look at that thing. Thunderbolt star. That's kind of good, doesn't it? Let's go with that. Yeah, my dude's looking pretty good. Looking pretty fly. I like it. How did you get decorations? If you look at your gear, you can see your main hand and your helmet, your hat, and your glasses have a tiny little, like, armor logo, armor icon, top right-hand corner. That shows you that that piece of gear is a cosmetic. So anything you drop on your lamp that's from one of those categories becomes a cosmetic. So you can click on it. And then it says, you can click on where it says selected, and then you can go and look at all the different things you have for that particular gear piece. All right. Also, you can go up here to your avatar, click your avatar again, and click on appearance here. And then you can go through all the different tabs and take a look at everything. Yeah. You can change your class, you can change your hair color, look. Oh, you can change your class. If you like being a little mushroom, you can stay as a little mushroom if you want. It doesn't affect your power at all. It's just the way you look. You can stay as a tiny little mushroom if you prefer that. Or you can make yourself bigger, you know? I like being the bigger one. You change your hair color. You can change the color of your mushroom. Oh, white and gold actually looks kind of cool, doesn't it? I like red though. <laughs> Uh, weapons, artifacts. We're going to be getting this tomorrow. This, 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 guys, this is what unlocks tonight. The Chaotic Warlord's Hammer. I don't know if we all get this or we've got to do something to get it. But yeah, this artifact, is we, we get this unlocked. Uh, it's available to possibly get tonight on tonight's reset. This big ass bloody hammer. There's also a Frostbite Sphere, but this is what it's called. The Chaotic Warlord's Hammer. That's coming at reset tonight. Yeah, it looks cool, doesn't it? Yeah, I don't, I don't know how we get it. We'll find out later. I have no idea how we get it. I have no idea. Just before Family Brawl, yeah. I don't know how we get it, though. Is there still the collab that was in the pre-release? Uh, I died. Here we go. The pre-release, the, the Korean server had the, the Pepe the Frog collab. I don't know whether they're going to bring that over to this server or not. I hope so, because it was kind of cool. I don't know whether they're going to do that or not. Let me try one time to kill this boss. He's being a bit of a pain. That's fine, isn't he? Eh? Let's time the shield. There we go. Shield up now. And I heal. Auto on. All right. So I've timed my healing again to be a little bit more efficient. We'll see. Let's see if we do this. See, sometimes just delaying those hills and shields at the start can actually help you a lot. Because otherwise, all your hills pop at the same time. It, it's not at the start of the fight. It's not good. See that beating this time. Look. Yeah. Oh, I ran out of time. Okay, damn. So it's a damage issue now. Okay, okay. Well, that's fine. But it's a good place to end anyway. Um... Go ahead and use these last few lamps. Hey Tabs, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. We're almost finishing now though. <laughs> oh, I got a oh, I don't want that. All right, yeah, yeah, we're gonna be finishing now anyway. Sorry Tabs, you're a little bit late today. Chat, thank you so much for coming through for today's stream. I really do appreciate it. Um, Again, 
the new the lord's mobile collaboration will be available from the next pack reset so you'll have that on the main server in about 10 hours ish or so so yeah that'll be that'll be coming uh so yeah have fun trying to get unlock your bits and pieces that you want to get unlocked don't go too crazy i ain't worth it man it just ain't worth it um and again there's another rng event coming as well with more up with more items so it's not like it's just this there's more to come more more pay to play garbage to come as well real disappointment that's the, that's the summary of the Lord's Mobile side of it. Real, real disappointment to see such an amazing IP ruined by pay-to-play walls everywhere. Lord's Mobile used to make collaborations that were fun and you could all unlock the stuff and enjoy playing around with the gimmicky items. Now they're just doing the same thing, but they're making it have paywalls. And these things don't even have stats. It's just stupid. It's just it's so crazy. Anyway, guys, that's that. I hope you're enjoying the Legend of Mushroom gameplay. Thank you to everyone that's supporting that. We had loads of people here for this afternoon stream while we've been playing the Mushroom game. <laughs> it's pretty cool for a little Mushroom mobile game, isn't it? Told you this was going to be popular, didn't I? I called it. <laughs> guys, I will see you tomorrow. I'll be back tomorrow. I don't know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, but we're going to be putting up some content. I'm going to have some videos for you guys tomorrow, and I'm going to have live streams tomorrow. So buckle in. Make sure your bell button's pressed. Smash this like button. Hit subscribe if you haven't done that already. Guys, you can also connect with me on social media. I've got my Twitter and my Discord links down below in the description below. And I also just started up an Instagram, which is at WorthyPrinceYT. If you're interested to see me waking up in the morning because i took a picture of myself when i was still in bed yesterday <laughs> the <other day. laughs> then come and join my instagram at worthy prince yt guys that's all you're gonna get from me today stay safe everyone have a great day and yeah that's basically it guys go away get out of here i'll catch you guys later stay safe and peace out latest peeps bye